So how about those Mets, huh? <laughs> God fucking damn it. <clears throat> Hello. E. And welcome back to another session of the Jade Wings Company. Uh, today we have the boys, uh, Praxin and Augustus, played by... Yeah. Uh, Play, played by <laughs> furry and other furry <laughs> furry one and furry two but, yes but furry two scaly boogaloo <laughs> oh my god um no not scaly draconic dr wait if it's draconic is that technically scaly or that draconic on its own thing um i if it's got scales you're a scaly <laughs> okay <laughs> that's Practice my more view on it yeah, practice more fur than anything, but he probably has some sort of like light, light scales underneath all that fur as armor because he takes more from the dragon blood, dragonborn bloodline. So yeah, he probably push get he probably push scaly there something then. <laughs> Hell yeah! All right. Uh, last time, uh, gentlemen, would you mind giving me as cursed of a rendition or summary of last session as you can? Okay, okay, so here's how it went down. So, bird girl, Andy, was caught, uh, met a dino, got caught by another dino, that, di that met friend dino didn't do shit, uh, but we all saw it, I fired arrow, Brassigar being Brassigar, just fucking Brassigar the T-Rex, Andy died, uh, the bird girl died, but bird girl provided the outside help, uh, meanwhile, uh, then while while pilfering the court, Brastigar, uh, Raptor came about. Brastigar and, and Augustus pretty much just threw all costs to the wind. Can you guys hear me? Uh, yes, we can. Oh. Oh, okay, sorry. I've been I just trying to speak, like, to say hi, and then I couldn't hear anyone else, and so I was like, oh, fuck! Anyway, sorry, continue. Uh, yeah. So, uh, Raptors came, uh, Brastigar and Augustus, uh, <laughs> Oh, what's, what's the most cursed way to say it? Bang pots and lids? They, sh <laughs> they bang towards the raptors. <laughs> uh, we're we're, bang we're wait, banging at the raptors. Wait, what? Uh, we banged what now? No, they here's the most. towards the raptors. Here's the most cursed way to, to describe it, right? Or command bangs pots at scalies. Yep. Or no, ba no, 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 Orc Man, no, 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 Orc Man bangs pans at Scalies. <laughs> Who banged yeah. what? No, nothing. Remember, yes. Brastigar and Augustus banged their, sh their weapons together in order to scare off the ra in order to try and make himself look bigger in front of the raptors that came after we killed the T-Rex. Oh, okay. uh, one of the, uh, a, po a whole pound of them jumped onto Brastigar. Uh, and then everyone else rushed to help Brastigar. Not practicing. Practice was like, what's the dirty? Had a scrap of meat, blew it off to the side while the other while the other pack of raptors went toward that and befriended one of them. Somehow, okay. with absolute luck, somehow gained enough magic to cast animal friendship and just be like, Haha, you're my friend now. Going a whole lot how to turn your dragon shit. Uh, then we finally made our way towards a raft, uh, went over the seas, came across an ugly ass fish. That thing is a face only a mother could love, and even then, I highly doubt it. Hey, who's got that beeping in the background? I have no uh, idea what you're talking about. What beeping? I, randomly, my phone just keeps, like, over Greg will just go screech. And I don't know if it's my phone, or if it's Discord, or if it's you, Greg. That's your phone, gamer, because I don't hear any beeping. <laughs> Yeah, I don't hear a beep. Okay. I'm well... eating my salsa in peace! Oh yeah, Beck did not join us for last session. Beck was off doing whatever fuck Beck does. Beck was being a brat and refused to go back out into the wilds. Are you gonna be a, you're gonna be a surpri surprise if you join us until we come back. Uh, oh yeah, <laughs> ugly, uh, ugly ass fish. Uh, we uh, got some damage off, then bigger fish came up, swallowed that fish, and then went on its merry way, and we were just like, let's get the fuck out of Dodge, and then we were on Volcano Island. Yeah, Volcano Island. Uh, I have a question for y'all. Yeah, sure. 
So there is a distinct possibility, peanut butter, sorry, I just went over a cattle guard. Um, there's a distinct possibility that I might be getting my own cat. I mean, I know Brandon has Bella, but I might be getting my very own cat and I'm torn between two names and I need, I need input. Are you in a car? Getting shot by uh, gamer. I'm driving back to my house um, and- Also remember that we're live right now. Are you guys live? Yeah. My, name, my oh, nickname on Discord right now is literally live. <laughs> Hi. Uh, Hello, audience. No, um, you guys are all on Bluetooth. I have the Bluetooth thing set up. Okay. Um, I just didn't... I don't know. I get weird about driving alone sometimes, and for whatever reason today, my anxiety was like, if you drive alone, you'll die. And I'm like, got it, all right. We're gonna... Discord it is. Well, yeah, you've yeah, got us fair. and chat. <laughs> Yay. Hi, chat. So, uh, I also so gave you more clout. You're welcome. So, so the the two the two names are uh, Poppy and Juniper. Poppy. Jun mm. I personally vote Poppy. Mm. <laughs> I like Poppy. 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 What does chat think? I can't see chat right now because I'm driving and we don't look uh, at our phones when we're driving. Oh, chat, oh, chat just yeah. says happy to be here. By, uh... Uh, By chat, chat. Says, chat says Juniper. Hi, Christine. <laughs> Christine, we're, we're, we're naming uh, Emma's cat. <laughs> so basically, cats are probably the equivalent of just, like, Emma's voted for one. Cat. Uh, yeah, basically what cat just did, it just, vote, like, did the equivalent of, like, holding his hand up for one vote, then put on a fake mustache and holding his hand up for the other. <laughs> yeah. Hold on. Um, <laughs> right, so yeah. is the consensus right now Poppy? No, I'm making a poll. <laughs> Make a poll. We are right. decided. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what should we <laughs> name Emma's cat? Poppy. I guess we'll Juniper. Juniper. I, its uh, name is Flip Flop. Or Flip -flop. or Brock Cigar. Will or Brock Will Cigar. Or Brock Cigar. Okay, the cat is going to be female. Her name is Flip Flop. There are your three options. Uh, no, her name. Everybody, Brock Cigar, Juniper, or Poppy. <laughs> Flip flop. Yeah, all right. And you can use your channel points to and bits to vote. <laughs> oh, you fool! I have forty k. Nah, nah, I'm not gonna use. <laughs> I know, I know what you're saving forty no, k for. I'm, yeah, I'm saving that. I'm just waiting to hear back from my landlord. <sighs> and I'm really hopeful because, like, I made some really decent ass points. Because uh, they originally he was like. No, because what if other people want to have other pets that aren't going to be as well behaved? And I'm like, then you just make me sign a fucking contract that I'm responsible for any damages. Monetarily and for fixing them on my own. And then, you know, also science says that pets are happier when there's two of them. So really, it's animal abuse if you don't have two. I'm just saying. Also, science says not my problem, bitch. <laughs> you just, just, ca like, just casually accuse your landlord of it. You know. No, because my landlord was concerned about like, what if other tenants? And I'm, I'm a little, I'm a little PO'd that um, they brought in other like they were like, well, what if other tenants want to do this? Well, I'm not other tenants, and you know me. You're related to me. Also, if so I'm you willing. Want no, if I'm willing to sign the paperwork, if I'm willing to take responsibility for the cat, if I've done my research, if I've made sure that this is a safe option, I don't understand why you're like, well, other people. I'm not other people. I'm me. Anyway, I'm just... Hello. He, Hello. Welcome to the D&D &D stream. A week. Hi. Sorry. <laughs> I'm late. Fun. Sorry. Hello. I'm uh... almost home. <laughs> Oh, no, we can't have that. No, can we? Have what? <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm talking to the vote, not you. <laughs> you get home nice you and safe and sound. Wait, is All right. the vote... Is the, vote the vote was... The vote was Go. almost tied. It was four votes for Brock Cigar, five for Poppy. <laughs> I tried to make it even. I just like being that type of guy. Uh, how long... How long can you keep the poll open for? Um, oh, no. It already ended. I can start a oh. new one, but... <laughs> I mean, name is Flip Flop. You know what? Fuck it. Start you want to pull again, but add in um, add, add in chat chooses. You know what? All right. 
If chat choose, okay, the one stipulation for chat choosing is that it has to be a plant-based name. You know what? No, Prefer we're not. Preferably, we're not, chat doesn't <laughs> choose. I choose, and I chose flip flop. We're not. We're not starting a new poll. Uh, no, we are going to create a channel point redeem <laughs> to name Emma's cat, and how whoever high? the first person redeems it gets to do it. Emma, how many points should I make this redeem? Um, a hundred thousand. Jesus Christ! Super no. high. How like about twenty k? Okay. What's what's okay? Twenty k is low. I have twenty k. Twenty k. I would hope you have twenty k. You're literally here every week. <laughs> Shit, did I miss my turn? No, I didn't. Okay, we're good. <laughs> I always get confused because I live across the street from a liquor store. I'm not telling what liquor store or how far away from said liquor store. But there's two signs that are identical. And so I always get confused. <laughs> turn up Quebec. 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 Why? Why, Beck? Right. I just want to eat my salsa in peace, man. I thought I had 15 minutes. Also, Angel, even if I'm not, I'm not naming the cat Flip Flop. You Why didn't not? have to join yet, Coda. You could have sat there and ate your salsa. Because I want a plant-based name. I thought I was going to miss something. Let's name, let's name the cat Coda Salsa. Let's That's what <laughs> If you want a plant-based name, name it Cactus. Okay. Cat, cat I'm accepting name cat. suggestions from everyone Just... except Angel. What? <laughs> okay, but Cactus is a really good name. Though. Asparagus. I'm name still it. accepting names from everyone except Angel. Here's a cucumber. Name it Flytrap. <clears throat> I am accepting names from literally everyone except... Angel, uh, Greg, and Cat. Aww. Catnip. Actually, I did think about that. I was thinking about doing the scientific name for Catnip, but uh, the scientific Damn. name for Catnip is dumb. I'm just call it Catnip, then. What are you I'm saying? Qu I'm quite aware of that. Because it's not aesthetically uh. pleasing, and Brandon <laughs> has said that if the name is too stupid, he's just gonna call it something else. But cat nip, just like every cat, so yeah. I mean, that's like fair. my cat, like my cat. Um, wait, our family cat is named Nibs, but I think that's stupid. And years ago, I just st started calling her cat, which is not confusing at all. Ours is called fucking Elsa. I had a cat for a little while and you named him. Um, Elsa. Oh god, what did I name him? Um. Fucking, I'm blanking on the god's name. Um, yeah, it was something Norse. Or oh, the Antoinette? What the fuck? No. no. Mary Antoinette is not a, North god, a Norse god. <laughs> See, the current name uh, for the current cat Brandon and I have is Belladonna. Like oh. the like the poison. And so I was thinking about something like <laughs> Juniper oh, or Poppy. Yeah. That's what the Bella. Yeah. Wolf but I was, Bald day, Ivy. That's what I need. My cat. Oh, if we're gonna call it something poison, uh, call it opium. Ivy. I was going no. to call it something with a healing property. Yeah, but also anyway. opium comes from yeah, like opium. Name no, opium comes from poppies. Just yeah. name it poppy. I'm naming it poppy unless someone else wants to redeem it and name my cat something else. Ow! God fucking. Because God. opium comes from poppy seeds. <laughs> I know. So no, can, can, we can we name the cat, um, what do you think, boat face? It just comes right back around! Poppy! Just name your cat Poppy. <laughs> I'm naming my cat Poppy. I don't know why this turned into such a big thing, but here we are. Ow. Okay. Because I should we really are learn. I should really learn that walking through doors is not my strong suit. Fair enough. Oh. But also, here's an idea. If the cat is male, then you could just name him Pop. Uh, it's gonna be a female just because, um... I don't know. I haven't had great male yeah. cat interactions. Yeah, male cats are really territorial. And it's Says a small the male cat. space. Y'all got like the wrong male cats. My cat Pumpkin is like a, a fat lazy boy. 
Yeah, yeah but your lazy scary. boy also has enough space to roam around in. Brandon and I's apartment is fairly little. Do not run oh. out the hallway. Also, he's a yellow tabby and he has one brain cell. I think all of you have all orange tabbies. Ow. We have yeah, I think he does have one brain cell. Okay, I have all actually walked out, but I love into him every single door frame in this apartment. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm 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 really good at walking, guys. <laughs> I'm not. But yeah, I think all orange tabbies have like one brain cell because I used to have one. He was dumb as fuck. <laughs> no, I think they all just share one brain cell. Oh, you're right, and then take turns with it. Yeah, they get very, they just get very territorial about who gets of who gets the brain cell, and no one whenever, gets it in the end. Whenever I think of pumpkin, all I can think of is uh, is that I'm photo mom. Coda sent Coda sent that one time. To, I'm suck mom. <laughs> Suck my mom. Ah. Yeah, I've got it. <laughs> yeah. Of yeah. course you do. Where is it? Uh, I thought you were. I thought you were gonna talk about like the oh one God, picture what? of pumpkin where he has a fat ass. <laughs> Why did you just walk in? You mean every picture of pumpkin? Or? Yeah. Oh, I mean this pumpkin. Here, I'll put the the photo. I can't find it. Fuck you! That's that <laughs> RPG. That's what. <laughs> Hold on, wait. Is it here? Is it here? Ah, here it is. Oh, okay, I found it. I hate this. <sighs> RPG. Hold up, if you're gonna show it to stream, can I crop it a little bit? Uh, sure. Uh, yeah. What are you? Oh shit! It's your dinner time. <laughs> Same brain cell. <laughs> oh my god, a hit tweet. If you want food, be polite. I want food. And don't close. Don't close the door to your food. Like, dude, I don't. Sorry. I'm stuck, mom. I'm stuck, mom. <laughs> you know what? You know the context behind that one was, I meant to say, I'm stuck, Mom, and it didn't work out very well. <laughs> you know what? I, I've got an idea. What are you doing? Hold on. Oh, I'm gonna, you, are you doing? You're gonna love this. Show it to me first before you show it on stream. <laughs> oh, you're, you already <laughs> sent it. What? I have no idea what's going on anymore. Watch, watch my stream. Uh, <laughs> oh, okay, now why? <laughs> <laughs> why? Good luck. Oh, please don't leave that there. Actually, <laughs> yeah, I'll delete it. I'll delete it. <laughs> no, please don't. <laughs> I said, I said I'll delete it. Thank you. <laughs> I'm stuck, so Bob. I'm sucking the spider web. I'm sucking the world wide web. Yeah. Man. I love getting wait. random follows from like other vampire VTubers. It's great. Wait, <laughs> let me show you Baby Jesus. Here, would you like to show Baby you Jesus. Baby Jesus? Sure. Consider L. Oh, God, I've got to save that. Consider L. There you go. It's just us talking about our Jesus. Literally every stream starts with us talking about random bullshit. What do you mean, cat? <laughs> yeah, I don't think this is necessarily like new. Here's my reply. <laughs> no, nah, but one day I hope we just dedicate our stream to just bullshit. Yeah, what do you think the birthday subathon's gonna be? A <laughs> section of our subathon. Where is the Ima Imagine one stream I ask. So how about the <laughs> Mets and actually mean it? How about those Mets? How about those Mets? It's all about those Mets, baby. It's all about the Mets, baby. Love the Mets, baby. <laughs> By the way, you love those Mets. By the way, if you haven't heard, uh, this lovely, uh, this lovely celestial over on the far left and I, along with our good friend, uh, famous VTuber Cynical Beanical, um, are doing a birthday collab on the 26th of March. Yay. Yay! Yeah, that's 20 days away! Indeed! It is, and it scares me. We're that, this many days hold up my hand, showing the numbers. We're still working on sub-goals and stuff like that. There's some tweaks possibly in the works, but... 
26th. I might do a 24 hour uncap subathon myself. Uh, so see you gamers there. <laughs> Damn. What oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, the Yo. made outfits. Yes, no, you know, the made outfits. So, so go to that say no session that week when that happened? Most likely. <laughs> Fair, uh, fair. Speaking of speaking of 26, uh, it has been 26 days since my university went on strike. Oh, how's God, how's you're that right. going? Uh, the earliest we can even see negotiations starting is the 14th. A oh, damn. Well, yeah. <clears throat> so, speaking of protests, like apparently uh, like before you say anything like that, let's keep anything that might be political Angel off of the stream. Okay. Has held off the damn. Crusaders yeah. for seven months. I am not attempting yeah. to erase anything, but that is not what this channel is about. So, I don't know. Just like supposed to be like another trucker math man, like COVID thing. Yes. So let's keep that off the stream. <clears throat> Alrighty. Thank you for seven months, Angel. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, Angel! Thanks for the seven months. If you're in chat, oh God, uh, Angel Hickman, thank you so yeah. much for the seven months. Just subscribe oh for seven God. months. Currently on a <laughs> yeah, thanks for the seven months, Angel Hold Hickman. On. Hold on. If you're in chat, say hi. Stop. Subscribe for seven months, but on a four month streak. Hey, we all have, you know, we all have times where we have to, like, unsub from people. That's fine. Uh, hey, chat, okay. remember okay. to sub with your Twitch Prime. <clears throat> Already. Yeah, it's just some Twitch. Bats rule and Venturers rule. <laughs> <laughs> hello disciple hello without further ado let us begin today's session um, i love lettuce and of course the head pats don't work alrighty <laughs> how dare <laughs> 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 would be complete without the scuff i know right well let's see about fixing that now Where is my fucking... What website is it? Why? Trigger fire? Yeah, trigger why do I, why do I do? Why do I think of such thing for myself? It's because I'm not logged in. That's probably why. Okay, let's... Um, issue a minor quest! Uh, what? Disciple, uh, you may DM me. Um, either on Twitch or on Discord, what you'd like this minor quest to be about. Oh shit. <laughs> I have a Find my question. car key. Uh, what is up? This is about Twitch, like, the, the bits thing. How, how work? <laughs> what, what do you mean? I just randomly see more bits, and I don't know how they get there. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're talking you about the like channel points? Yeah, give me like this little channel, channel points. points. Yeah, uh, those things. Oh yeah, for channel points you could do easily stuff like what we need for head pass, do love and support for mod team. It basically something you just amass when you watch a stream mm. longer. If you do other stuff like follow, subscribe, usually those are like multiply. And those are basically like for fun little things you can do. To affect it. stream, yeah. I've heard that in the early days of channel points, you could also time out and ban other viewers. Yes, you could. <laughs> I mean, technically, uh, yeah, technically, you still can time out people. It's now, uh, it's now, like, a manual thing that mods have to do when they redeem it, but there, some people have, like, time yourself out or time out another, uh, another chatter for, like, five minutes. <laughs> Yeah, we'll also the that. default for channel points used to be double point gain with just a normal sub. Now it's double point gain with tier 3 sub. Yeah. And you um, just like gain them by watching. Trigger mm -hmm. fire, why, why you do and this by, to me? And by you should yeah, be channel points. Really weird you, and by collecting an easy mass of them, you can do more and more reward. Like that's how I was able to do the divine intervention last time, so Andy didn't die. Thank you, I appreciate that very much. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, you know uh, Oh yeah, uh, go to- Andy almost died last time. It was almost died that when we were just hanging out casually. I thought I did, maybe. <clears throat> you know what? Oh, yeah. We are going to change it up a bit, I guess. Um... Uh, the oh, game oh, or the oh, channel points? The head pat. Ah, um, right. If I can find where I have the original GIF. 
There we go. Coda, who would you like to head pet specifically? Uh, my wonderful DM. <laughs> oh, thank you. There we go. Pet this wonderful vampire that deals with our bullshit. Look at all of us. Exactly. Head <clears throat> oh my god, look at that. We're loving the shit out of them. <laughs> Hell yeah. Alrighty. <clears throat> so, yes, um, until I get the head pat redeem working um uh the way it used to before uh anybody who redeems head pats can put a head pat on anybody they want uh and it will stay there for the whole stream Ooh. Uh, that's a lot of padding yes <laughs> wait can, and, can we can we get a, a head pat redeem on the head pat redeem and just stack the head pats you can oh, no. <laughs> You can you can put it on whoever you want, and you can place it wherever you want on me. Everybody else, it's just on the head. Um, stack the pat! Stack uh, the no. pat! <laughs> I demand the stack pat! Stack the pat! I'm <laughs> saving my points. Same. I'm gonna hold on to mine in case of a rainy day. Time stack, stack the pat! Stack the pat! Act oh, and since I know. since uh, this isn't through VTube Studio, uh, I don't have a Never. limit. I don't have a limit on how many of these I can put. <laughs> oh God! It's gonna go to Doug. It's gonna go to Doug Dimmadome Len. Yes. Doug yes. Dimmadome will do the Dimmadome. That's right. That's right. That's right. Not right. Not right. That's right. Not right. Not right. Not right. Doug I, can't I always believe. forget to do that. Honestly, I think TV peaked with Doug Dimmadome. It did. The Dim <laughs> and if I ever do a Risk of Rain stream, um, you guys will see that there is a Doug Dimmadome mod on Risk of Rain too, and it is fantastic. Um, oh shit! Rain. Oh man! <laughs> oh, and the Risk of Rain two DLC just came out. Yes. Oh. Alrighty, <laughs> let us begin tonight's session. <laughs> Sweet. Thirty After minutes like in. Half an hour. Yes. That's uh, not half an hour. We've been streaming for half an hour. <laughs> what the fuck? So, <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> A real request: stack the pat. Oh my god. Immediate rest of redeem: stack the pat. And stack the pat. Pile. Oh, Christine wants to head pat me apparently. So one, one for one stack for oh. K and one for. A... There you go. Coda gets me. head pat. Uh, yes, I saw your DM disciple. Um, and uh, uh, due to certain circumstances that the party is in, um, they will not have this quest available yet. But it will be put up on the quest board, and so they will see it in the future. Will the party um, ever actually get to the job they they signed up for? Oh, no. don't worry. I just no. need. Oh, don't worry. I just needed you guys off the continent for a little while so I could do things. Um, okay. Oh fuck. <laughs> those things oh, are man. now ready. <laughs> um, I love it when we have a filler arc. <laughs> yes, this is literally <laughs> this has literally been the three filler arcs in a trench coat. Uh, <laughs> hmm. Um. Yes. So, you guys. Uh, just landed on Armot with the intention of heading towards the volcano um, in uh, in the mountain range to the east. Uh, after a somewhat harrowing um, uh, journey across the water, uh, Proxigar, Ernest, Augustus, Andy, and Praxin, you guys are all. Standing there on the beach, uh, you've just pulled up your raft uh, so that it won't, um, uh, it, so that it won't uh, drift back into the water. And you all turn around to gaze at this island. You see a essentially a blasted heath of an island. It is a lot of lava rock, um, old corpses of trees. Uh, there's some green uh, here on the edge uh, where you guys are. Um, you see, you can very easily see us, uh, a couple groups of dinosaurs, uh, to the north, and you see Beck. Be how? 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 What's how the fuck did you get Beck? here? Hey, guys! You're not, oh, hi, Beck. You're What's not like carrying Beck? Hey, guys! Beck is back. How? 
Oh! Uh, a dinosaur a took you here. Bit. Wasn't I carrying Beck? No, Beck was I... no Beck was back at base. Yep. The way we're spinning it, the why we didn't show up last session is because Beck was being a big baby and didn't want to leave. <laughs> <laughs> we leave the comfort of the fort so after being get... attacked and fucking sideswiped by dinosaurs. So how did you get here? I, I um, I think, I think they left me. Who? Who? I was hanging out with like some of the skeleton guys. They they were like. They were on a convoy and also looking for you. You were just hanging out with them? I mean, I was trying to find you guys and they said I would, they would drop me off with you. I mean, I guess they did that. They did. But I don't know where they went. I've been standing here for an hour. Well, here we are. Oh, hey, Beck. For, oh, hey, Beck. for context, you guys did not see Beck when you guys were, were sailing up on the raft. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, hey, Beck, I have a new friend. You have a what? <laughs> Point justice behind me, where Maverick the, rap the Utah Raptor is standing. Oh, yeah, you tamed the Raptor. Yeah, meet my new friend. I was about to ask you about that. Where'd you get it? <laughs> I befriended it. It's a really Perhaps good we idea. walk and talk? Uh, Beck, uh, Maverick just looks at you with staring cold eyes. <laughs> Beck's yep. tail just starts, like, shaking. No, 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 they are not food. But they're fun to mess with. Make me an animal handling check, Praxon. Okay. <laughs> this ought to be fun. That means... 24! A 24, uh, you kind of, uh, uh, just, like, like, uh, turn, turn Maverick's head away from Beck, and he seems to forget about her. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Beck, Beck, please, uh, Coda, please be wait. Does Beck not just, does, does Beck just not care about gender? Nope, they don't care about, care about pronouns, you can call them whatever you want. Okay, I keep getting well, confused. You can flip flop between them, they, they, they use all the pronouns. Alright, alright, cool. Anyway. You know when you, when you get a dog a new chew toy and they just, un all they want to do is to chew on it? Yeah. That's what I, that's what I imagine what, uh, what Maverick kind of wants to do with Beck. It's like, oh my God. That, that's, a really, that's a really nice chew toy. I want to <laughs> just squeak. <laughs> I will squeak. Perhaps we should walk and talk? Yeah, I would, sure. I would be more productive. Sure, what, what, what are you guys up to? <laughs> what, oh, what's you know, destroying the today? magic towers. You're not paying attention to what they relayed what happened to this island. No. We just killed <laughs> a shark. Big towers, no magic. We did not kill a shark. We killed a T-Rex. The shark got eaten. Who do you think ate it? Me. No. Not too. It's it, right it was, there with the moon and Ernest pats their stomach. <laughs> it, it was it was one of the mess and elephants that holds the world up. Uh, um, can can Prasen just look out in the water and see if he can just see the giant fish that ate the shark? Make me a perception check. Okay. <laughs> that is just not taking it. Never out. mind. I know. You <clears throat> you look at the water and it takes you a minute or two of just like staring at it. But you think you see a a dark uh, something dark moving in the water? Yeah, we got that. We got that. Anyway, tower to the tower. Okay. The tower of power. No, the tower of no power, rather. The tower of anti power. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that kind of like spins on their heel and starts walking in a direction. Not even sure which way. Uh, do we uh, have a map? you want to fo follow the group there? It's over there. <laughs> uh, Augustus picks up back by like the scruff of their neck and just like turns them into uh, at the direction we're walking and puts them back down. <laughs> <laughs> like a, like we just one of those walking like they, toys. They like swat swat at your hand as you uh, let go of them and just start walking in the direction you pointed. <laughs> 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 
Okay. Yes, well, all right. All right. Oh, my God. You, me, and making your way uh, across this island, it is extremely flat. Like, not completely smooth, but there is no real rolling hills or... And there's no jungle, no no branches for you to uh, to trip on. It is all pockmarked volcanic rock. <clears throat> As you are making your way through the island, you can see, you know, that you don't really encounter very many creatures as you are heading towards the volcano. Um, at one point, you uh, in the distance, you can see one of the. Uh, uh, one of the mighty ambushers just slowly lumbering across um, across the rock, but it doesn't seem to pay you any mind. And it uh, takes you a good couple hours, uh, but you are at the foot of the mountain range. Looking up, you can see... It's not, you know extremely tall uh but the uh one peak stands out against the others uh it is in fact uh a decent deal shorter but much wider than the other uh than the other mountains in the range uh and you can tell from the ash and just general toxin in the air above it that that is the volcano you were looking for <clears throat> you can also occasionally see shapes moving in that miasma. That's an inviting thing. Uh, like a threat. Just barely peeking out from over the top, you can see solid white marble in the shape of a four-sided pyramid. Huh. So, no. were we given any instructions on how to dismantle these things? I would assume blowing it up, but pardon me if I'm wrong. I've never, I've never witnessed a, a are we, are volcano we before. But are we taking something specific from the tower to depower them? Yes, you were told that each of these towers. Uh, were powered by a magically charged crystal. Yeah, all I, all, all I have to do is just pour a magic crystal. He done it. And they've done that before, right? Like the cannon. Uh, well, yeah, but did they say pull or shatter it? They said uh, that they said to remove it. Uh. Um, make me an Arcana check, Ernest. Oh. Arcana. 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 Roll 20, if you please. <laughs> that R will use Kana. That R will use Kana. Absolutely. So, uh, Ernest, you you feel like you know in this in this kind of situation, it doesn't really matter which you do, uh, as long as the crystal is not there powering it, that this tower should um, cease functioning. Whether you destroy it or you just physically remove it, you think that either will uh, will have the same effect. Yeah. So I'll go rip it out. Yeah, I think ripping it out would be the safer option. I don't really want it blowing blowing up in my face. Yeah, I can't imagine many of us would like that. What do you think would happen if we dropped it? You want to like drop it? I mean, trust me, I have experience pulling crystals from cannons, so... Not really a good one, huh? That... Listen! <laughs> mm, I don't know, man. Sounds pretty sus. What's that word you're saying? What the fuck oh, do you mean, sus? Is, does it stand for sustainable? Suspicious. Uh, I've never heard this abbreviation before. Must I don't be a know any of those words. Must be, must be a city term. 
Probably. I was about to say, no, no, you've no, never, never heard of the Among Us. No, you know this, Beck. I've been, I've been raised in the wild. I wasn't talking to you, I was talking to everybody else. I didn't do anything. <laughs> it's squirrel a squirrel term. term. <laughs> it's a squirrel. <laughs> It's a squirrel yeah. squirrel. It's I a think squirrel. I, I think I heard some of the some of those kids playing it. It's like some hit new schoolyard game called Beside Us. Augustus, ah. you take. <laughs> Augustus, you take seven psychic damage. <laughs> Augustus, are you okay? As you have a massive headache. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, our word pain among us. <laughs> you know what? Actually, yeah, hold on. Let me do something real quick. <laughs> oh, <laughs> uh, let me open up the crow's character sheet. Casting power word kill. Hey, can I make that non lethal damage? <laughs> Fear? Not the God crow. damn it. <laughs> Uh, bu 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 bu. Oh, power word pain isn't on isn't on my roll twenty. God damn it! We <laughs> <laughs> pulled off my D and D Beyond then. Hey, D and D Beyond, wins. sponsor me. <laughs> I like how everyone on Roll20 changed their name to Master Character and then it's just Coda. <laughs> I don't know how to do it! It's in the gear area. Like the yeah, gear is like the, the first, like the top make... option. Personalization yeah. display, display name. It, I know, it took me a while to find that out too. Anyway. Um, <clears throat> but They're yes. happy? Yep. Fuck. You gave in to peer pressure. Yee, peer pressure. Yo, can we stack that, Pat? Absolutely. Stack that, Pat. Stack that, Pat. What are you patting? Oh, head pat. Yeah, we're, we're patting the head pat. Uh, okay. <laughs> so, you guys have reached the volcano, and it sounds like you have a plan. Now the problem is, how do we climb that? How steep is the hill? Uh, actually, how, I, how, 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 how tall is it? How steep is it, also? Because uh, I can fly. We so, climb it with hard work and determination. I can climb. I mean, have you ever gone hiking? Yeah. Yeah. It's a moderate incline, and you think it's maybe a mile. Okay. That's not so bad. Should I just make our way up? Well, onwards. Make our way. Uh, oh, this is Make nothing. Our... Making our, Making our way, way downtown. Making our way. Making our way. Making our way. I cannot hear a thing you said, Kota. Oh. I was gonna say, and Bex is like, this is fucking nothing! It starts just going up. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot you tried to climb the trees in that massive forest. <laughs> yeah, not to mention the fact that there's no trees on this mountain at all, so there's really not much to trip you up. Uh, and it's all kind of like crumbly volcanic rock, um, so you know, with a little bit of effort, you can make each step kind of, uh, kind of stable. Yeah, but also, I'm a city squirrel. My specialty isn't trees. It's buildings. And buildings are made of cobblestone. If this isn't cobblestone, cobblestone, but okay. <laughs> I mean, what is a mountain but just a really big cobblestone? It's volcanic stuff. Why cobble yeah, here? A really big cobblestone. Regardless, <laughs> this is fine for Beck, and Beck starts going. <laughs> but the real question is, why cobble here? Yeah, why cobble here? Why not cobble? What? What? Cobble? Where's a mountain except a really wide-sized crystal? Why cobble is cobble? <laughs> uh, Augustus and Ernest, you both take. <laughs> Seven psychic damage. <laughs> I'll keep going. Oh wow, it's one more and one less than last time. Like, exactly. I'll keep going. 
I can do this. I can do this all night. Can you? <laughs> can you go I mean, I, all night long? I can. Well, the study man can. I can do this all day. I wanna lie. I hey, don't give me copyright claims. Uh, <laughs> life isn't a highway. No one wants to ride it. <laughs> I'm gonna give you up. Cat. I'm gonna let you. Uh, Augustus, you take. 314 no. psychic no. damage. Y'all, I'm fairly certain there's going to be a fight somewhere at the top of this, so perhaps maybe, and this consider. Is it. <laughs> yeah. Rick Roll just came. Rick Astley just came in, killed Augustus, and left. Rip. Doesn't elaborate further, please. You take four thousand six hundred and ninety-seven no. psychic damage. Sixty-nine. Uh, Sixty-nine to center. Uh, six, nice. <laughs> nice. I'm, I'm anyway. going fucking insane. <laughs> anyway. Okay. <laughs> I, I was like, Augustus is having like a major splitting headache at the bottom of the hill. Beck turns around and be like, Oh, shut up, baby! Get going! <laughs> you are able to make your way to the top of the mountain. <laughs> Yay! Uh, Rob Segura's gonna start running, and he'll run right past Beck, and he'll say, I'll race you to the top. <laughs> wait, what? Oh, wait, no! <laughs> Wait, no. So how far away is it now? <laughs> Bex says, bet, let's go. Well, I did say <laughs> that you guys made it to the top, but I guess they're racing there now. Um, yeah! Fucking Augustus chases them down. I'm um, gonna... I'm gonna say that if Andy sees literally anything that could potentially be dangerous and or start a fight with them, she's going to immediately, like... Activate her angelic form or whatever it's called. Uh, yes. First. So, uh, Brock Cigar and Beck, I need both of you to make me either an athletics or an or an acrobatics check. Oh no! Wait. Do I, have, so do I have? Do I have two as well? Because I acrobatics. I let's go. Are you also racing them? Wow. I am 20. chasing them down. Yes. Then you will as well. Because they're ahead of me. Oh, dirty we'll also join the race. God damn it, Mark Cigar! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> uh, Beck begins just full on, four legged, sprinting forward. 22. Uh, hey. Ernest, you are unable to catch up. You're you're running you're running pretty well, but that squirrel is made for well, running. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, behind you, Beck, you hear thump, 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 and Brock Cigar is just. Barely squeaks by you. But um, I think I, I think I pit is just Earl from from Cloud Chance and Meatball doing that whole sprint. <laughs> Brock Cigar's man. arms are pumping, uh, and he is just he catches up. He, he it takes a, a hot like thirty seconds. You he, but you catch up to Beck and you make it uh, ahead of Beck, and you are going full on ahead. And I need you to make me a deck saving throw. Oh no! <laughs> oh oh no! Oh wait, where's Augustus? I thought Augustus was running that way. Oh yeah, Augustus is joining the race. Well, then roll. <laughs> oh, uh, just eleven. See. Uh, you are you are just like you have a splitting headache, and it is making it very hard to concentrate on running. Um, Brock Cigar. Mm -hmm. You are full on going ahead. You have passed Beck. You are the chat of the party. <laughs> um, hey, where'd the ground we go? We already knew that. Where'd the ground go? Oh fuck! <laughs> ground rocks ago. Uh, you made it to the top very quickly, uh, and you fall off the edge and just barely Did manage I not to catch. See the ground, like. So Did imagine, forget? if you will, you were running up, right? Uh -huh. You look back at Beck, like, ha. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever forget one of volcano? <laughs> And you so are good. now hanging on to the edge of this volcano. Beck I, finally catches up with uh, the hanging rock scar and says, So you win! Good job, buddy! And then um, leaves him. Uh, <laughs> I will grab... I will grab Beck. Uh, make me <laughs> contested athletics checks. Oh, or no. not, not athletics, dex, dex, dex. Dex, dex, dex. dex, dex. dex. alright. Yes. Dex check. Dexterity. I, I got 20. 
Well, wow. I can use athletics though, right? Uh, this what? one is this one is specifically dex for speed. <laughs> oh, okay. You can use athletics for the power of running, but this is spe specifically to see how how quick you are. Okay. You got you got the ch you got the Chad power stride, but you got the speed to back it up. Yeah, I know. It's just usually like grappling is athletics, not a athletics. Oof. Uh, you, Bruxigar, you, since you're hanging there off, off the cliff, you go to, like, you lift yourself up and go to catch Beck. Beck is still got adrenaline pumping and, uh, nimbly steps to the side. I think that Beck's a backflip. <laughs> I will say, it, 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 it would not be hard for you with your strength, Bruxigar, to just pull yourself back up. Yeah, I'll just pull myself back up. What was that for, buddy? <laughs> What do you mean, a sore loser? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Beck, make me a deck save. <laughs> deck save. Deck save. Seventeen. The fuck around is human to find out is divine. Uh, <laughs> Beck. Uh, yeah. Brock Cigar, you you're like dusting yourself off after you pull yourself up, uh, and you look you you're looking kind of down while you're doing this. Uh, you see a very large shadow. Um, Beck, you feel like the the hair on the back, uh, uh, on your on the back of your neck, uh, or actually all the all the fur on your back, uh, kind of spring up at once <coughs> in a oh shit, and you quickly bend down as a massive form sweeps past you and just barely missing you with its talons. Oh, oh, oh wing of terror! Right, hey, right. All right, that's that's nice. I forgot. All right, as yeah, you see. This, uh, flying huh? back up away from you. That's a bigger than T-Rex. That is. is it. Huh. That and is. Why has my music stopped? What the fuck? Oh yeah, wing. Oh yeah, they were called wing terrors. Nice. I know. Oh it is. man, that's a, that's a that's a really big dog. <laughs> what dog have you seen? What dogs have you seen? That doesn't answer my question. It's an answer to my question. That's not a that's not a dog. That's definitely a bird. <laughs> hey, yo, this counts dog. as something scary, right? Are we about to enter initiative? Because goddamn. Uh, it is um flying back back up into the mi miasma of which it came. What the fuck was that? That would yeah, be one I... of the th that would be one of the things they wanted us about. Do you didn't learn how to pay attention? <laughs> I pay attention to the things that are important to me. It didn't seem important. Oh, and your survival's not important to you? Uh, apparently not. That's what I thought. Shut up! Okay, so important question. What is the site at the top of the volcano? Like, is, uh, it, is the tower, like, just a single pillar in the middle of fucking lava? Yes. Or... Uh, it... Have you ever... Who all has seen Shrek? Yep. Me? Oh god. Oh, you like see Martin, like last night. You see a rickety wooden bridge <laughs> extending from the edge of this volcano about 20 feet to your right, uh, making its way towards uh, this white marble tower. Um It has definitely that. seen some dis some dis some disuse as of late. So we should probably only go one at a time. Or some of, us should, some of us should hang back as support for air cover in case those things have any other ideas. And plus, some of us who are extremely heavier than most don't just break the bridge by walking. Okay, question. Yeah. Other question. Is... Can we see the crystal from where we are? Like, is the... Is the... Is the, is the place where the crystal is? Like completely walled off or is there like a window or anything like any open space where we could see have the thing in sight yes uh you can see near the top of the tower uh, it is about a 50 foot tower um about actually 30 feet from you since it goes down into the volcano 
um, <clears throat> you can see uh, what look like large arrow slits in the top, uh, one at each end, and you can see purple light coming out from them. Uh, hmm. You can't directly see the crystal um, due to the ankle, but yeah. you can see the, the, the light coming from it. Okay. Now, third question, my most important one. Are they big? Are they big enough for a human to die through? You're not going to throw yourself into an opening that you... high up. That high Make up? Me no, a I'm just going to require some aid. <laughs> Make me a perception check. <laughs> Oh, yeah, cause, cause, uh, cause like let's say Augustus throwing you last time worked so well with the stronghold. Well, I'm not asking Augustus for help. I mean, like if you want me to throw you, I can do it again. Probably no, not. Style. No, as... no, 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 no. I no. I do believe what in your strong stature. Uh, uh, that's persuasion. So who are you trying to persuade? Oh wait, that's pers <laughs> <laughs> I misread. I'm sorry. What is uh, your no, this performance. Hold on, stop, ro stop rolling, stop rolling things. What is your bonus to perception? Okay, wisdom. Okay, but what's the number? Zero. <laughs> ah, then you may keep the nineteen that you rolled for that first persuasion check. Wait, what? Oh, the nineteen. Okay, because it's nineteen. You rolled a nineteen <laughs> plus you... six. I will let you keep your first roll. If you miss, if you misread per, uh, perception as persuasion and performance, I think Listen, you failed that perception check. <laughs> I see, I see per in tiny writing, and I'm like, ah, yes, perception. <laughs> Ernest, yes. you don't think that a person could easily fit through there? Beck would have to like squeeze um, to get through there, so it wouldn't be very quick. Uh, you do feel like maybe a uh, a small spell or a ranged weapon might make its way through, though. Ah, damn! No, no winged, no winged, uh, winged taxi. <laughs> oh wait, oh, I could. You said a spell could make it in there, right? Yeah. Oh no. As long as you, as long as you roll well enough, yes. Oh, oh, that's so tempting! Do it. Do it. Well, you got the you know what? Yeah, make or break. Uh, I'm going to get away from the group, like, just a little bit. And I'm you going to whistle, I'm going to whistle as loud as I fucking can. Like, what? put both of my hands to my mouth and just, like... Do that one kind of whistle that, like, I don't know, soccer soccer supporters do, where, like, where they put, like, two fingers on each side of their okay. mouth and just go... Whoosh. What are you trying to achieve with this? I'm trying to get the attentions of one of the wing terrors. Oh, no. Make me an animal handling check. Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm going Steve Irwin. Oh no! <laughs> it's going horribly. Hey, could be worse. Could be a nat one. <laughs> so you do succeed in calling one of these creatures down. Oh no! Ernest, Ernest, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm getting a taxi. Uh, what does a 15 a hit you? Oh fuck! It does. <laughs> uh, so this creature flies by. Uh, and it stabs you in the shoulder with its uh, long beak, and I need you to make a con save. Oh, as you shit. feel something being ejected into your arm. Oh, fuck. Okay, what exactly did you try to accomplish there? Can I, can uh, I try? Dying, probably. Can this I thing have passed by my melee range? Okay, that's a 12. Oh. <laughs> uh, so you take uh, 35 damage combined. Oh, fuck. And uh, you begin to feel very drowsy. Um, oh fuck! Broxigar, it is flying very fast, but you will be you will be allowed to um, you'll be allowed to make an attack, um, an opportunity attack. I will say that with that, despite your sentinel feet, because it is flying, if you hit it, it will not stop in place, but it will fall. Damn it! I wanted to grab one. Once Broxigar is done, can I? Can I do something? Absolutely. 26. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> so, like, the plan was 
to like uh, have one uh, of the wing towers just swoop down and just grab a leg and just fly away with him. That's fourteen points of slashing damage. Absolutely, you you hit this uh, this creature pretty solidly, and it spins, uh, kind of like corkscrews in the air, and uh, skids on the ground uh, about. Uh, 25 feet away from you guys uh, by the time it's done. Andy. So, about how high up is this window? 30 feet from where you guys are right now. So that's what gonna be like... It would take about 45 feet of movement to get there. 45 feet of movement, even if I'm flying? That is that is your flying speed. That oh. is how long it would take you to get there for flying. Uh, if it was walking, it would be 90 feet of movement, approximately. Um, I'm kind of guesstimating. I'm not doing fucking Pythagoras theorem in my head. Um, okay. But to, uh, walk to walk across the bridge and then walk up the tower, it would be about 90 feet of movement, 45 to fly it. Okay. That's, that's about how... That, that's okay. So she's going to uh, wing up. She's going to turn to Broxigar before she wings up first. She's going to take off the sack that has the egg in it. She's going to hand it to Broxigar, and then she's going to look him in the eyes and say, hey, if this dies, I will murder you. You can certainly <laughs> try. Do not let it die. It's your, and then, it's your responsibility. Yes, well, I don't exactly want to get um, plucked out of the sky with, you know, a really important dragon egg, so can you just... I mean, if you don't want to, I'll just give it to Augustus. Okay, give it to him. Okay, I give it to Augustus then, and then I make the same threat. I activate the wings, and I'm gonna fly up to the window, because I am oh, small cool. enough to fit through the window. <laughs> You're a dick! I'm so flat! Uh... <sighs> You're a medium creature. Um, I am... Three yeah, feet tall. Feet tall. What? what? Thirty feet tall? Three feet. Oh. Oh. Oh yeah, halfling or something. Oh. No. No, no fit through window. No. <laughs> okay. I said Beck could like squeeze with your wings. There's no way you're fitting through that window. I think they're like magic. The wings are like, solid though. Yeah, they're just intangible. They're just yeah. sort of like magic that lets you. Fly. If something comes and contact them, I don't know if anything would actually. <laughs> I mean, if if K says no, then it's no. Then I'm gonna go with no. So I'm at this window. What can I see? You can see inside. Uh, there is a room with a staircase that's leading up to it, uh, okay. and there are six spikes coming out from uh, each of the four walls, the ceiling, and the floor that all meet in the exact center, and mm -hmm. there is a faceted gem rotating in the center. It is a light purple in color. Um, okay. And how many sides it has seems to change every second. Okay. So if I were to say, I don't know, firebolt this thing? Is there a way for me to tell like, how uh, effective that would be? Make me an arcana check. Um, excuse me, roll 20. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> you have no idea. You're hitting magic with magic. Literally anything could happen. Okay. How strong do I need to be to carry Beck up here? What's your strength? Uh, 13. I'll say that you can. It'll be a bit slower, but I'll say you can. I think I have just enough movement also, to do wait it. wait a minute. I'm a category small creature. Wouldn't that make Andy a category small creature too? I'm reskin. It's a reskinning, not uh, a fast in, thing. You in, uh, For any of my games, you can make your character as tall or small as you want, but your size category is whatever it is for your uh, race. Hmm. Um. Oh, I am going 
to go down and grab on uh, <laughs> Beck. What? What? What are you doing? I just imagine you just like fly over and not say anything, and you just like pick, pick Beck up from like under. <laughs> You're small. The and just start flying. It's like, what are you doing? You're small. Like flap your like make yourself aerodynamic so this is easier. I, I, and they just go limp. <laughs> Ernest. <laughs> Ernest, um, as you're watching all of this, uh, just you pass all. I just see she's she's fine. That's cheating. <laughs> and Ernest falls limp on the ground. <laughs> That's what I wanted to do. <laughs> Picking up Ernest. <laughs> um. So I imagine I get back up there now. What? What? Why? What did you bring me here for? Can you fit through the window? Emotional okay. support squirrel. Fit through the window. They kind of examine it for like a little bit. I. It'll take a bit, but yeah, I can fit through here. Why? Can you fit through here with enough time for me to get down? Yes. Okay. Hurry up. Okay. <laughs> Check, like, are the windows the only way in? No, there, well, there's no, a bridge and a door. There's a bridge, but we're just trying to take the aerial aerial uh, route because I don't trust that bridge. I don't we'll trust the bridge. the bridge. Beck, I will remind you that you are an arcane rogue with a mage hand. I am, yes. Uh, Braxgar, uh, are mm -hmm. you the only one crossing the bridge? Uh, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, you are able to make your way across easily. Alright. Alright, let's get up across the bridge. Uh, hold, on, hold, on. Uh, hold, hold on, can Prakton uh, use one of the uses from the healing kit on Ernest? If Ernest is still afflicted by poison? A it's healing poison. kit doesn't fix poison. Um, uh, a healing kit, and if unless you have the feet, um, the healer feet, a healing kit can stabilize a dying person. Or stop uh, stop the bleeding condition. Okay, never mind then. Uh, I've been hit with a three ad with three ads. This is I hate it here. I was just basically like them injecting me with chloroform. Subscribe. So. <laughs> um. So Beck, are you like using mage hand? Or are you crawling through the window here? Like, I'm I'm gonna crawl through, but I. Don't... I haven't seen an opportunity to use my mage hand yet. That's the whole. <laughs> I don't know what. Kay, what, what was your point of bringing that up? Because I am aware. You could just, you could just use your mage hand to grab it. Why yeah. crawl in? Why crawl in there? Just use it. Okay, but would the fit, would the crystal fit through the window? Yes. I mean, I can't imagine oh. it's like that. The crystal is about the size of your fist. Oh, oh my God, I thought it was larger. Oh no. Oh, I I thought it was larger. Yeah, I could just use my mage hand to get it. I thought it was like the same size as the fucking like master emerald from Sonic. If my math is correct, Beck only has fuck. Okay, if I can travel thirty seconds um, uh, every six seconds, and it's forty-five. So forty-five times three, one hundred thirty-five. There's my mage hand. We can just use my mage hand. Make me an arcana check, Beck. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Mage hand. Is there any way for me to help here? Uh, uh, unfortunately not. Um, <clears throat> Beck, you try to push through the magic, but it is just not... Uh, you're having some trouble. Luckily, this is a cantrip. Yay, I don't lose now that I've moved across the bridge, can I just go in? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I'm uh, just gonna go in. Beck, you are attempting to to use your mage hand. You just see Broxigar walk up the stairs. <laughs> what the fuck? I got it. Don't like, you worry. I just I'm afraid of booby traps. You know. I'm not. I'll keep going. I mean that's fair, but if he gets caught in a booby trap, he he'll live. Yeah, he's yeah, a that's thing fair. boy. You want to try Ernest again? Just falls back asleep. Doesn't he have your egg? 
No, no. Augustus does. Augustus does. Augustus does. This okay. is why I didn't want the egg. Okay, okay. Perhaps you're, just you're on your other side of the bridge. Beck, I will you're... allow you to attempt your mage hand once more before Proxigar gets to the crystal. Sure. Yes. Come on. All right, uh, Arcana check. Yes. Just yoinking in front 20. of him. Oh, dirty 20. You're yoinking in Absolutely. In front of him. <laughs> Beck, you are oh, able dude. to shoot out your mage hand and you uh, grip the crystal. Can, can I take it out? Absolutely. Yes! <laughs> Mine, bitch! Roxigo, you see the crystal just float away towards Beck. Oh, you got it this time? Good job. I'll make my way down. Hey, uh, Roxy, I made his just... way up just for this. That's rude. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How? Back back four kind of like a, does a does a raspberry at Roxigar and just like leaves his line of sight through the uh through the crack. I will say <laughs> angelic window. form lasts okay. long enough in this scenario. Oh uh, no, the question I figured out she had like at least sixty seconds, if not more. Not sixty, at least thirty seconds, if not more. Um, my other question is, do we feel the magic users, uh, a little better about <clears throat> magical abilities here? Yes. Um, okay, cool. the, it's, it was almost unnoticed because of how much it was just there and a constant thing, but everybody who has any sort of uh, actually everybody because you either have magic or have magic items um you feel a, pr uh, a some pressure relieve um it's still there but it is less can i hear uh, andy oh, you fine. hear in your head continue you are nearly there uh ernest you hear in your head, run, fucking run, get up, run, what the fuck are you doing? Um, and, uh, trying. <laughs> you are still unconscious. Uh, Augustus, you turn around as you feel the hair on the back, on your back prickle, uh, as this creature has, um, has taken flight again. Uh, it was cha uh, running towards you guys and is taking flight uh, with its talons outstretched for Ernest. Oh, fuck. Uh, uh, I step, in, I step in front of Ernest uh, and get into a stance with my shield and spear and just get ready to stab it. Can Prakton try and shoot at it with the bow? Uh, we will all roll some initiative. Okay, oh, fuck yeah. Okay, I still have, like, I think it's three turns left with this. I will say yes. Oh, that right. makes me happy. Three turns. Uh, in his head, in his head, Ernest just responds to his patron like, "Okay, I will admit it was done from me, but you have to appreciate the gall, right?" No. No. Honestly, I have to appreciate the gall. I'm gonna be honest. No, I'm gonna have to call you on your dumbass, right? I'm talking to my patron. You don't hear me. Hold up. I'm gonna real quickly because I like visuals. I'm gonna make the the whole are, like. Are we, are we drawing Ernest? the map again? Uh, Ernest yes. is really good at being a sandbag. Ah! A sandbag? I'm... What yeah. happened there? <laughs> Rule twenty is being weird for some reason. I'm gonna cry. I'm a oh, sandbag. Question for the DM: Which side is the? Uh, it's going for Ern Ernest, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Ernest, I'm just gonna it's okay. Make... You're the most powerful among us. You ate the goddamn moon. <laughs> I ate the moon. <laughs> eat the moon. I made the tower, guys. Isn't it pretty? <laughs> I made the bridge. Mm, yes, a circle. You know, I was picturing it like a square. Hey, hey, you know. Dark, dark. <laughs> no, I'm gonna no. be that guy. No. I'm gonna make lava. <laughs> 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 I appreciate. Yeah, missing... <laughs> yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Y'all missing the nuances. <laughs> the You're doing a wonderful thing here. Just a teeny tiny little lava anyway, pool right uh, here, just in the corner. Traction initiative. Yeah, like even a little. Fourteen. Bit of... Oh wait a minute, my initiative. Hold up, I got distracted. <laughs> Don't forget the cookie token. <laughs> I know. I know. 
Oh, 21. Wow. 21. Don't forget to not die. Don't forget 21. to not die. Uh, Beck. Yeah? You are at the top of the tower, uh, clutching your prize oh, in hand. Uh, you feel a strange energy radiating off of it. Um, I where do I have the thing for this? Oh, oh, oh okay. <laughs> um, I have a thing for this. Hold on, I gotta find it. I, I, I swear to God, if Beck starts co collecting the infinity, the infinity stones in this I, world, I wouldn't very much be. Afraid. Don't you mean the never-ending gem pieces? You mean you mean the infinity no, nuts? No, no, the don't, infinity don't, nuts. No, don't you mean? Oh, you mean the uh, chaos emerald? Oh. <laughs> the chaos emerald. <laughs> Shuckle, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. You mean the chaos emeralds? Oh yeah. By the way, listen. Jack, apparently, I don't Nickish think we want to take infinite nuts. <laughs> no. Infinite nuts. We're gonna start taking psychic damage again, and I would not blame <laughs> the crow-faced god or whosoever is bestowing upon us this. Oh. Way, this pain. Impersec calculated risk but failed the test. <laughs> yep. The infinite. Uh, uh, but basically, I'm saying, like, if Vex starts, like, collecting powerful gemstones, you know what? Good for them. So, uh, <laughs> Beck. I. Yes. Uh, you. Uh, I will add to your inventory uh, oh. the anti magic gem. Oh. This is cool. a special gem. That allows you to cast the spell anti magic field once per day. Oh, oh wow! Fuck. Oh fuck! That's Yo, a hold on. hey guys, I'm gonna keep this. All right, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna now. take the next one. You you essentially have the magical version of an EMP. Yep, it's mine now. You mean an? Am I all right? Because like just telling me that, I have plans no, to get my oh, nut back. Amp. No, no, it's an M. EMP. Uh, an amp. Okay, an so. Amp. I get to keep this. I already have plans to get my nut back. Er, okay, so uh, this so this gem has uh, ten charges. Uh, it can cast anti magic field with ten charges, and it regains one charge daily at dawn. Heck yeah! Oh my hey, god, they're gonna be ideas for like. <laughs> New Beck design, just like covered in these magic jewels. <laughs> oh, no. Ah yes. I'm gonna the be pink squirrel. Out, yes! No, you just, you just have those. You have like the three anti magic gem floating around you with the with the oracle nut you got that you pitch shoplifted. Oh, we need to get you some uh, some ion stones. It's the pimp squirrel. Yeah, the pimp squirrel. Oh, no. God bless. I love it so much. Ion <laughs> stone. Squirrel. Congratulations, you can now cast the 8th level spell Anti-Magic Field. Yay! Yeah! <laughs> Yay! As, um, as the Arcane Trickster, I don't think I can cast 8th level spells. No, oh. you are able to cast it with this gem, using 10 charges. All so, 10? Yeah, the, the gem has 10 charges, and you can yeah. use 10 charges to cast the spell. He regains 1 charge daily at dawn. Yeah, so, so you can use it once every 10 days. Gem. Yeah, as an arcane jester, the highest level I can go with, uh, highest spells I can cast is level, f is, uh, level four. Doesn't matter. So, because yeah. it... You're not it's using a, a spell slot. Item. Yeah. No, no, I'm not, uh, I'm just saying that this is the upgrade for me. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> oh. I'm not saying, like, I can't use it. I'm saying, like, this is amazing because normally I cannot cast these yeah. spells. Because you're a half-caster. Yes. But yes, Beck, uh, you have achieved this gem. You have it. You, it's radiating power. You feel pimp energy radiating through you. Uh, and then you hear a screech <laughs> and look back and this, this bird thing is going for Ernest now. <laughs> okay. Uh, there's four. There's four gems, right? Three. three. There are three. Oh, three. Gotcha. Uh, I'm going to cast Firebolt at it. <laughs> Absolutely. Make me an Arcana check. Alright. 13. Oh, damn it. Absolutely. You are able to cast your spell. <gasps> yes! Oh, yes. oh the cat lowers with each gem stolen. Oh, yeah. You move, you, yeah, you, you remove one of the gems so the DC to cast spell probably weaken. Yeah. Yeah, nine fire yeah. damage. 
The Legend well, of Beck and the Crystal Gems. Nine fire damage. Oh, fucking god damn it. <laughs> uh, absolutely, that does hit. Uh, you feel you hit this creature with your spell, and uh, you actually see that the fire seems to burn it more than it should. <gasps> Ooh. And Again. more than it should, you say. You and, begin um, to see why anti-magic towers were put up on this island. Ooh. Oh yeah, they're insanely oh, weaker. Oh yeah, they're weaker to magic. Duh, not the whole reason they were made. Fuck yeah. All right. Well, uh, I'm gonna use my uh, cunning action bonus action to dash across the bridge. Are you still up you in the air? You are 30 feet in the air. Am I still up in the air? Yeah. Yeah, just yeah I'm air. still holding you. Can I? Can you drop me? <laughs> uh, no, because that'll hurt. Becca's squirrel. I'm a squirrel. My maximum velocity is like high. <laughs> maximum <laughs> velocity. All right. If you want me to yes. drop you, I will drop no. you. No. It is, I will say it's a free action to drop back. You want? Oh, drop me. No. Oh no. Got it dropped. And you have added weight of the gem that just adds to your whole turn of velocity. Uh, uh, then it doesn't add much. Beck, you hit the ground and you take nine bludgeon damage. That's completely fine. That's nothing. That's still stupid. This is ankle. It's That's still nothing. nothing. <laughs> and I'm going to. Uh... Hey, guys! <laughs> oh, cool. You're right in front of Maverick. <laughs> ah, shit. Now you stuck there. Scooch myself over here. <laughs> Coward. And that ends my turn. <laughs> uh, Broxigar, uh, you are... I'll say you're at the bottom of the stairs when this all goes down. Where are the stairs? Inside the tower? Or... Uh, you're like right here. Okay. Uh... I would like my head pet to go to someone who is not being padded. Uh, someone roll me a d5. Okay, uh, I shall roll d5. Uh, Use my action to dash there. A one, Brox, uh, Broxigar gets head pat. Oh, <laughs> pat, pat. oh. pats for Brox. Pats. pats for the box. I, I just like to think that Beck just got all across uh, it, like, hey, what's up? And then he just felt like. Maverick just breathes down their neck like ah, and just jumped. <laughs> and now they have to earn us. That is exactly what happened. <laughs> All right, that's the end of my turn. Alrighty, Andy. Lit, lit. All right, all right. Um, let's see. Let's make sure. Aha! Exactly. Perfect. So. I finally get to cast some spells, and I'm excited. Um, I am going to attempt to cast a uh, fireball. <laughs> what? Okay. Where's the target? <laughs> uh, right there. And what's the radius for your fireball? I think it's 20 feet, if I'm not mistaken. It's, it's 20 feet. Yeah. Absolutely. Everybody okay. will be outside of the range. Thank Perfect. God. Uh, Arcana check first? Yes, Arcana check. I have nothing to give me advantage. Okay. Oh, dear gods of roll 20, please let me succeed. Ooh. God damn it! Andy, you begin pouring out uh, hot arcane energy into your hand. It is being compressed into a ball you throw it yeah i know but not all of it throws yeah. roll me damage oh <laughs> for fireball yes roll me fireball damage okay <laughs> 27 um i need can i make my own dexterity saving <laughs> Yes, uh, you and the creature will both need to make deck saves. Okay. There's 15. I don't even beat my own oh. saving throw. Oh, no. uh, let's see. Oh, no. I you could say that blew up in your face. I feel like I should mention that because I'm in this form, I do... And I do extra radiant damage equal to my level, so there's an extra 8. 
it, wait, it's a fireball range. Flames that are out there right now. You wait, take fire... 14 fire damage. Okay. And the creature uh, also takes 14, but it looks to do more than that. Um, and then that uh, radiant damage. Yes. Wait, uh, the some of the fireball explodes in your face. Uh, and uh, it does singe you pretty badly. Uh, this creature is consumed in holy fire. It is oh, wow. screaming as it uh, combusts and its wings turn to ash as it falls down into the lava of the volcano. <laughs> Do I take oh. any of my own radiant damage, which is why I asked? No. Okay. You will gain 1,100 XP. Jesus. Fuck 1, yeah. 1,100, damn. Hey. So that puts oh, us at 40,150. And as we drop initiative for clearing this tower, let's see. Uh, where no. did I... Uh, where did 41, I have this written? Down? Uh, 4150? No, it's, uh, yeah. Uh, 40,000. 40, yeah. Okay. 40,000. 150. Damn. Uh, fuck, where did I have this? I'm losing all of my shit today. <laughs> That's okay. Um... You guys... Get... Oh, fuck, there it is. Uh, another 5,000 XP for clearing the tower. Jesus! All right. Okay, so we're at 45, 150. Yeah. We'll need a couple that's, uh, of those. That's, that's a lot of XP. Easy. That's quite a lot. Hey, we should, like, just go around town killing these guys. Oh, my God. Which no. also means... Well, the fuck I'm off. kidding, of course, because this is a research base. And hey, guys. Wanna, you know, poach. <laughs> what? 3,000... More XP, and we level up to level 9. Let's go kick okay. another tower's ass. No, that doesn't sound right. We just leveled up. That's 40. That's 48, yeah. And, uh, reach level 9. Did we level 48, up 48? 48? Yeah. yeah. 48,000. Oh. Okay, I might have been thinking I fired that. Yep. <laughs> Let's go kick another tower's butt. Well, we gotta Damn, go. We, got, but... we have a bit of a way to go. I mean, yeah. what could possibly go wrong? Don't forget about Ernest. Hey, Ernest, you good, buddy? Ernest is still asleep. Uh, uh, um, and he's in, 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 in I his can sleep. Use I get to use things. In his sleep, Ernest just goes, hey, hell yeah. Um, <laughs> wake up, I, you insufferable uh, moron. Okay, well, Venom. Can I do... Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm oh, just... wait, I have prayer of healing. Listen, um, patron, I'm very sorry. I was just, you know, trying to get like short rest buff stuff. Can, so, question. Also, uh, I'm gonna be gone for the next like half hour. I'm sorry. Oh uh, shit. Oh, uh, that's fine. If, I, Life if I'm casting a ritual spell, do I still need to roll that arcana? Yes. What? It's okay. not gonna. Wait, do you have ritual casting? Yeah, I'm a cleric. Okay. I don't think prayer of healing is a ritual spell, though. Oh no, I was. It's just a ten-minute cast. Yeah. Okay. What would they? Forgot how to, to tell to on roll twenty, up. which I forgot how to tell what roll twenty, which is. Uh. And it so will... I was like, oh, this C, this obvious, not C, this, this obviously means that it's fucking a ritual cast, even though There's... this is the C corresponds to hold person and not prayer of healing. Fuck, where'd he mm. go? I'm smart. Um. I. There's an R, I believe there should be. Oh yeah, no. There's a little check mark here that it will it will say whether it's a ritual. Um, so like how it has that little like black C next to some stuff that says the concentration. Yeah. It would have an R like that. Um, if it was yeah. a ritual spell. No, I was looking down at the C and I was like, that obviously stands for ritual. <laughs> it's not even the right spell. Um. Anyway, so Arcana. Yes. It. Come on. Is that enough? Uh, yes. 
Okay. So everyone, and I'm gonna upcast. No, I'm not gonna upcast this because I should have specified that previously. Um, I'm gonna cast a level two. Everyone, oh, sorry, I forgot to move over here. Um, <laughs> everyone get 16 health back if you need it. Andy. Yes. Oh, wait, hold you. on there. Oh, yeah, okay, continue. You feel a connection Yay. deepening. And uh, look at the bottom left of your character sheet. Oh. Okay. Oh shit. Okay. Was oh. I at one before? You were at one before. Okay. Wait, no. You should have been at. You should have been at three before. Yeah. So I don't know. Oh, there we go. Uh. What is the. This thing. Oh, someone got a piety. I got a piety. I forgot to fill that in before. Um, uh, okay. You started. You started at three piety because of your backstory. Um, got it. And it's the thing we discussed before. Um, uh huh. But it has just increased. Okay. Yay! <laughs> I'm gonna take my egg back. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, you're from Augustus, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, Yay, we lived! So... Does, uh, Ernest wake up? <laughs> no, uh, no, Ernest is still asleep. Can I try to shake him awake? No, 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 look. Absolutely. I'm still, <laughs> let, let I'm him still asleep. How, how often do they sleep? Uh, Proxigar, you go over and you shake Ernest, and he wakes up. Oh. Ah, ah, I'm, so I'm sorry, I I'm sorry, I'll- Oh. You- you were- you were um, asleep, it was weird. Morning, sleeping beauty! Is that what yeah. sleep is? I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Have you never slept before? Have we no, never- Not willingly. A, a couple times. Not willingly, not willingly, though. How long has it been- uh, you just don't sleep. Has that been a whole life thing, or? I, I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, but, okay, okay, I'll admit that may have been a whole life thing, but you know, just, just normal, normal human thing. You know. I don't know what's That's up with you, but uh, come on, it's time to wake up. <laughs> And Beck gets like gets under um, Ernest's back and starts pushing them up. <laughs> uh, okay, fine, fine, fine. I'm out. I'm out. Oops, shall, it is. shall we continue on then? Uh, which, yes. island do we, which island do we go from here? Cause from the from where we are, both of them are like a ways away. How'd you get here? How, how did you guys get here again? Rickety oh, raft. Yeah. We got raft. Then we use the raft. To where? Where are we going? Which um, one next? Whichever island is closer. The island to the east, and then we'll go to the island to the north. Should we okay. consider uh, resting before we head off? Oh, I feel great, so no. I'm good. I just was. I is it? What time of day? Uh, it is. Uh, it is the afternoon. Okay. Probably about like four ish. Okay. So worst case, so worst case scenario, we spend a good chunk of the day traveling to a nearby island, uh, rest on that on said island. Like we could get to the center island, rest there, oh, make camp there, and then in the morning we just go for like one of the other islands. Sounds Wait, cool. I want to test something. No. Well, uh, I mean, I when, trust, when... I don't trust you to test anything anymore. No, when we are at the raft, I want to test a little thing. Um, what do you want to test? Uh, I'm going to put my ring of water walking on. Oh, no. I want to test if it works by, like, you know, stepping stepping on the waves at the beach. Wait. I'm sorry, but oh. didn't you say there was a shark in the waters earlier? The we shark was in the water. 
No. We killed we, it. We, we did, did not, not. We did not kill it. The bigger fish did. We killed We're it. We're taking credit because I that fish the is not there. Fish. <laughs> Uh, so there's another fish in the water. Are you sure you want to oh, water walk oh, oh, on inhabited water that could on, eat your little feet? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do these amulets still work even with the other two anti magic towers up? See, that's uh, what I want to test. Okay, he's trying to talk. Uh, yeah. Uh, guys, I am going to have to pause this for uh, a minute. Um, everyone take a uh, food, drink, or bathroom break. Uh, we will take yeah. a five minute break. <laughs> Oh, okay. Or we could just sit here and roleplay. Yes, absolutely. You can do that too. I will be back in a minute. Okay. Shall we start walking? Should we like at we least all... start walking? Aren't we already at the raft? raft? Aren't no. we already at the raft? No. no. I mean, no. But we're like, talking about I... like where we're. Let's just say we're walking down the mountain and we're just talking and roleplaying if we want to do that. Yeah. Uh... That's what I was picturing. I'm just saying, are you sure you want to walk on water when uh, there yeah. is a bigger fish? I, oh yeah, you. Oh yeah, your risk taking really helped you last time up on the mountain there. Listen, I wasn't going to cross the water entirely. I just want to test because so far, we've like the magic items haven't done anything for us with those anti-magic towers up. But now that we've dealt with one may have they gained some effect back and that's what i want to test because if my water if my water walking ring is wait you have a ring of water walking i may have nabbed it like an hour ago when do you have that i may have nabbed it on that uh big mega metal ship like the one where we pick the cards up. And, and what did what did you steal from that? Not I did that? not steal it. What do you take me for? A thief? Yeah, exactly. Wait. Thank you. <laughs> no. Anyway, at least you admit it. Anyway. See, I'm like, I'm like, if I'm... anybody's a thief of this group, it's this guy. I paid for it. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. Sure. Sure. About. Says the one who's getting nabbed. So, like, very, very quick side note. I have trained my cat, or not my cat, but the dog. My cat to um, whenever she wants to play with the laser pointer, she'll come and very politely tap on my leg when I'm sitting at my desk. Oh, you oh already my God, have that's the cat? Adorable. No, this is Brandon's cat. Oh. <laughs> this is a. Oh, like, wait a minute. <laughs> no, this is this is one of the cats that Brandon's had for a while. Ah, I see. <laughs> it would be. My cat, because this one only uses me for food and for laser pointer. She doesn't ever use me for cuddles or attention. <laughs> Come here. I mean, that's fair. You wanna, you wanna show, you wanna show people what you look like? Um, okay. <laughs> I mean, ah, ah. You're loading. Oh, it looks so upset. Aww. I know I'm she's so not happy. Lame. There we, hey. I am happy. You kept trying to jump up on my lap. This is what you get. I'm being angry, baby. So, chat to ex describe what's going on here. Emma is holding up a a, a brown and black kind of like striped tabby. Think McGonagall. Is pouting. <laughs> Think McGonagall. McGonagall. All right. McGonagall. Uh, by underneath <laughs> their uh, their armpits, and they are looking very upset. Angry. She a little angry. So she likes to jump up on my lap and then use it to get onto my desk, but I'm trying to stop her from getting on my desk. Because every time she does get up, she knocks over all of my whiteboard pens, which are magnetically attached to the like arms of this bookshelf type thing. I know what you're talking about. It's really annoying when you do that because then I can't find the only pens that work. Okay. Anyway, back to play. Sorry. <laughs> I just thought it was really important to note that my cat- Cat moment is always important. Fair enough. Intelligent. Actually, while I'm back in the roleplay, actually speaking of the merchant ship and they kind of turned to Andy. You! Uh, I, have, I have a bone to pick with you. Me? Also, yeah, it's very rich from you to call me a thief. <laughs> I was joking. You yell at me, 
and you will yell at me for and they put up their paws doing like the air quotes stealing something from <laughs> uh from the ship and then you use your wish your one wish to give it back to me what's up with that i'm sorry very what? wishy-washy about some things because yeah no what the fuck <laughs> <number you're laughs> chastising wishing. me for my sword and then like the next day you were trying to help me feed it what's up yeah, if you want to start chastising, you keep chastising. She just takes her egg and walks away. <laughs> Ernest yeah, says that as you. like... Ernest just says that with like a side glance to Broxigar, like... So full disclosure, that, full disclosure, I now have madness. Oh right, yeah, from, from yesterday. With the T-Rex. Oh, with the raptors. Right. And it's indefinite. So I, the only way I could think of like portraying Andy not giving a shit anymore is just actively antagonizing people. Oh my god! I mean that's fine. Like I'm the uh, me, but not like doesn't care. No, I just I feel like I should explain that yeah. to you guys that so that you don't fair. think I don't. Mm -hmm. I'm not like flip flopping on my character because Andy actually doesn't condone most thievery, but also you know what? Fuck it. She doesn't. Right yeah, now. I kind of figured that. Oh. I'm just like role playing, my guy. Yeah, you, yeah, you, <laughs> that has a bone to no, pick with you. No, you. Coda, you just weren't there last time. I wasn't. No. And so I figured I should probably let you know what's going I think, on. No, I, I, I think Greg told me about it when we yeah. were hanging out. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. I, I, everything except for Maverick, because I wanted to see Coda's genuine reaction to that. I told almost everything about what happened in the last session. The uh -huh. I relayed all of that. Oh, so, yeah. You know, and Andy takes her egg and walks away. <laughs> <laughs> I've had full on yeah. heated arguments with uh, fellow players in character, and then we were like, yo, that was a really awesome argument. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I yeah. Mean, I, 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 still, yeah, I, no. Not, nothing has yet to top that moment after the dragons and orc with Braskar and Practon had the little standoff. Oh, yeah, no. That was, that was chef a, kiss. That was, that was just a good moment. That be kind of like ru runs after. um runs after Andy. Hey, I'm talking to you! And I'm not listening to you. Wow, what a shock. Damn. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, man, I thought my patron was sassy. Alright. Fracture just did a very sharp inhale. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> just kind of, kind of crumbles. Right, what was that? Uh, Who is right, that? It was just like putting their hand oh, uh, on their chest with like that expression, like oh. So uh, <laughs> so you got the new IQ change? What the fuck is up with that? Sorry. Um. That's good. Yep. You've been acting. You're you acting a bit off there. What the I fuck am is not. Up with that? All right. All right. Yeah. Thing. How the hell did you get on fucking like furry? Li I always forget the name of it. <laughs> Yeah, we still don't know her too well. She's still pretty new. Oh yeah, we we we, uh, we never tackled that. Yeah, how the hell did you get on that? Uh, get on Kraken? How the hell? You just said you just fell asleep and then you were there. How? Got exponentially lost. Yeah. You slept across an entire continent and sea. Especially if we take an operative word there. Yes. I mean. If we take into account the fact that you are, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, from the Isle of Monsters? Not from, just visited. Well, so, visited, but before arriving on Grokian, you were there, I think? And no. No, okay. And I again, I have to ask, I don't remember, where did the, how did you join, how did you come to join the Jade Wing? Uh, hmm? I fail to see how that's any of your business. <laughs> so how do we, well, how we are do we know? also members of the Jade Wing Company. Are you, yeah. are you actually how do we a have... member or are you just pretending to be? Yeah. This I am is quite literally member. our business. What? You're the first Jade, uh, Jade Wing member that we've met throughout this entire fucking job hunt. <laughs> and we only met you off continent. I um, am in fact a member of the Jade Wings. 
The thing is, I think I do remember seeing her brooch, so she would be a true member, it, since, you know, now, we found now, those in our pocket as soon as we now, signed up. Now, how now, how do we know that that's not someone else's, and she just pilfered it somehow? You can't out that. I'm not, trying to, I'm not trying to make like make you an evil person or antagonize you. I'm just trying to look at all options here, because that could Wait. very well happen. Oh my god. Okay, question. Can we make our brooch glow? Yes. Okay. Because I remember you mentioned something like that on our first uh, on our first quest. Uh, yes. You also know that they are attuned to you. Yeah. That was the that was the thing I wasn't watching. Uh, so Ernest just picks up his brooch, and he starts making it like ever so slightly glow. And he's like, "So, basically, I don't really know all of the semantics on that thing, but if she can make it glow at the, at the very least, we can we can know it's hers, since you know we can." This, the, those are basically attuned to us at all times. So, would Can you I... care to demonstrate, no. Andy? <laughs> I was not aware of this pro. Like me, the character, me, the player, not Andy. I was not aware of this property. Can I make <laughs> mine glow? Oh, absolutely. Okay. Right. Sure. The uh, each of your brooches is essentially like a badge. That is like, this is this person, and they they belong to the Jade Wings. Okay, yeah. can I make mine glow? I just like all of you looking for adventure. I don't see why you're all so suspicious all of a sudden. See? Because, because there's so much we still don't know about you. Right, fine. I grew up in here that note, And they like gesture to Praxin. Um. We don't know that much about each other! Except that Rex was an asshole! <laughs> I, I wouldn't call it asshole. Or to be fair, I only- I A don't very good that warrior. That I don't really have that much of a story. I was born and raised in the wildland. There's not really much to say other than just mother and father just teach me general knowledge and to hunt and survive. What's your favorite food? <laughs> Why is that important to know? Is Largest eye roll in the world continues walking away. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I haven't tried squirrel meat yet. We'll see what happens. I mean, we're happens. already <laughs> we're <laughs> already like kind of walking, so we assume uh... like Andy just starts power walking. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then let, and then Beck gestures towards uh towards uh, Ernest. You favorite food? I've I've. I've, I've this is so sudden. Uh, <laughs> bread. <laughs> Look, food is food, man. Well, well you think oh, about yeah, it. No, point, the... uh, point to Brock's cart. You, favorite food. Ernest just corrects himself. The, the bread part meal. is actually kind the of garlic bread. You know what? Fair. And then they point to um, Augustus. You, food. <laughs> Uh, I really like pig leg. It's good, good texture. Never tried it. And then they point to Andy, who is uh, currently walking away. Food. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Beck. We are all made of food. I'm walking with Andy. <laughs> I meant you, asshole. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, I'm. Tri tri uh, you guys are always so Does Turkish special. delight exist in this universe, Kay? Sure. Turkish Whatever delight. The fuck that is. Uh, and you now, know Pat, the thing and... in like Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe that like she gives the little kid to seduce him away from his family. Yeah, that doesn't tell me what it is though. All I know it's this <laughs> we, this this it's, shit that some um... British kid sells his family for. <laughs> okay, it's like a. <sighs> Hold on. It's um, like a thing. gel based like. Candy kind of thing. It's, it's made like of a... starch and sugar. Oh, like oh, it man. is literally starch and sugar. Wow, it's, um, a, it's like a cubed gummy kind of. Yeah. I was about to say something, and I'm like, uh, let me check if vanilla's in the chat. 
Uh, yeah. It's uh, usually... Uh, she is not. Damn, that does sound like a British dessert. It's um, usually... <laughs> it's a, like, classically flavored with, like, rose water or a mastic gum or bergamot orange or lemon. For the longest oh, time, I thought sauce. Turkish delights were, like, savory. <laughs> But after all said and done, Fraction would just grab him back by the crap of your neck. All right, all right, all right, Smarty Pants, what's your favorite food then? <laughs> Nuts. Walnut fudge, what about it? What a surprise! Yeah, I'm not surprised by that nut thing either. <laughs> then Fraction just dropped back, all right. All right, bonding time over. Raft. 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 Flying push and they get up and dust themselves off and like uh chase after Andy. Andy? Andy. Andy. Absolutely. I do uh, not trekify my name. <laughs> you guys Andy. <laughs> Andy. Oh my god. Ande. You guys yeah. make your way to the Thank raft. You. <laughs> uh, which island are you going to next? There is Samat, Komat, or you could go back to Ismat. Uh, Broxigar, which island are we going to? We're going to... I thought we were going to... How did you pronounce that? Colmont? Uh, Colmont. Colmont? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we're going to Eastmont, and then from Eastmont we're going to Colmont. Yeah, How are you going to move the raft, then? I'll pick it up. Well, Wait, I'll, didn't I'll, we have to I'll, I'll drag it. I'll drag it. I, I don't think I could probably pick it up entirely, but I'll, I'll drag I it mean, at the very least. Between, like, you and Augustus, y'all can probably have... carry it. Don't yeah. we have a tamed, like, dinosaur? It is a medium-sized creature. Oh. I think I'm stronger than that thing. It's not like you guys have, a, have like, one of the large creatures. This is a Utah Raptor. It's not that big. <laughs> <laughs> it has it has a strength between, of between like Broxigar and Augustus, like y'all can carry it probably just fine. It has a strength of thirteen. <laughs> mm. I am much We're stronger talking. than the thing. We are we are, are strong. Are you ego talking or are you actually being logical for once? No, oh, I actually know this to be truth. It is I a very twenty-one. That. It is a very lean creature. Yeah. Um, I was just start pushing the raft back in the water. Why, being why, honest. Why the sudden interest in, in Maverick? I mean, he literally came on the raft with us. How does he taste, though? Uh, actually, Broxio, that is statistically incorrect. You are not faster than it. No, I said it's probably faster than me. Oh, okay, I misheard you. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Oh. Alrighty. It's probably faster than me, but I'm definitely stronger than it, so... Oh, absolutely. Um, you guys, uh, it, it'll take you uh, two days worth of travel um, to drag uh, this raft uh, across the island. Um, but you're able to make it to Colmont without incident. <laughs> no, No scary... No scary thing? No. Uh, no. You guys make camp during the night. Well, not even make camp. You guys make it, you know, back to the, the compound um, by evening. And so you're able to sleep inside the walls. What are the general reactions? <laughs> hey, I live in your walls. <laughs> um, I live in your wall. The, uh, the doctors are intrigued by... Uh, uh, by the fact that uh, you seem to have tamed this creature. Um, Dr. Grant will warn you that it probably will take longer than a day to truly tame it, uh, but you seem to have its um, loyalty for the moment. Okay. I'll take your word for it. Can I give them screeches? Make me I, would not, I, check. I would not... I would advise that you don't. But... I got lucky with magic for this for for, make, for trying to befriend this guy. But the screeches. 
<laughs> you can try. Just don't. I'm just not gonna. Just don't hold me accountable if you try to oh, no. your fingers. Ernest, <laughs> you begin extending your hand towards this creature. It is watching your hand, very intently. Can Fraxton just make a motion to just like don't, don't, don't try it? To Ernest or to Maverick? <laughs> More so to Ernest. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Don't. Just don't. But. Are you still trying to, Ernest? There is no glory to be gained in these. Yes. <laughs> Make me an animal handling check at disadvantage. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> this is it's just. Uh, hey, Ernest. Baby. Was. <laughs> Ernest, was that your dominant hand? What about that twelve? You begin to you you get, you get begin to get closer to Maverick, and it just kind of like you know how a cat is when you go to pet it and it doesn't want to be petted. Oh, it just avoids me. Yes, uh, like its feet aren't moving, but it is just like moving its head out of the way. <laughs> Ernest uh, pulls back, heartbroken, <laughs> just like oh. Uh, can Ma uh, can Preston, uh, give uh, Mavic a head pat? Be an animal handling check. <laughs> just Twenty-four. Like, heartbroken, heartbroken. I say. <laughs> oh, absolutely. Um, it is still like laser focused on Ernest's hand, and you just kind of scratch the back of its head. Uh, good. Uh, Ernest is heartbroken. He's like. Oh. Look, I can't take a bit, alright? I know, but... Dog. <laughs> it's not... I get it. Like... Yo, damn, what breed, of dog dog? Is the... what breed of dog is that? <laughs> Deadly. <laughs> what breed of dog is that? Big. <laughs> Mesozoic. <laughs> alrighty. Cretacean. But yeah, uh, the next day, you guys are able to make your way to the next island. With no incidents. Uh, you see some fish in the water um, while you are uh, rafting there, uh, but uh, nothing bothers you. See, no Thanks, business. God. Oh, yeah. Uh, Ernest, are you going to test out that uh, water walking thing? Well, I mean, I was meant. I was meaning to test it, like, on the volcano island, but you know what? Maybe when we're at the beach, I want to test it. See if it works. Uh, I'm gonna put the ring on just in case, anyways. Uh, you are at the island, so you're at the beach. Oh yeah. Well, I put the ring on and I try to walk like around the waves of the beach. The water holds you for a second. Um, before it begins to balloon inward, and uh, eventually your weight breaks the surface. Hmm. Not what is it? Not what I was expecting, but above my expectations, nonetheless. <laughs> Wait, what happens if I like try to jump off when it starts blooming? Like when it starts caving in? It's not like you're standing on it and it starts to cave in. It's more like as you're putting the pressure on it and you're trying to step on it. Oh, uh, okay. So like, so like they're standing on a thin sheet of ice. Basically, so, like yeah. that. It's okay. basically like gelatin. Kind of. Oh well, test done. Uh, not quite there, but it'll get there soon. Anyways, on board. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, Kolmot is a very swampy island. Uh, there are... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, there are tall, willowy trees with thin branches that sink da back down into the water and might even sprout new trees once they have um, uh, dug back into the... Uh, mucky ground beneath. Um, you can hear the sound of uh, many creatures, uh, small and some large, uh, deep in the swamp. Hmm. 
Yay! Uh, I feel like I step if I step in the wrong place, I will be I will be taken under. <laughs> uh, you want to just, you want to just ride on my shoulders? I'm good, thank you. All right. Honestly, for a swamp, it looks really pretty. I mean, you could always go on a pony ride with Maverick. No. no. I'll pass. All right. You're lost. You do know. Shut up. That uh, the um. The tower is in the middle of. Oh, let me scroll down. Uh, is in the middle of this lake here. Hmm. Ooh, boy. Ooh. Is it like the same height of tower with the same windows in? Uh, I mean, you won't know until you get there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's start um mucking our way through this. Making our way. Making our way downtown. Walking, Walking fast. <laughs> Very Guy stressed out. Right so and inbound. <laughs> <laughs> Making my way. Absolutely. I'm on my way. You guys. Way. Uh, oh, hey. Does this mean we have all of our spell slots back? I'm so sorry. Oh, yes. You did get a long rest. Okay. Hooray. I just didn't want to give myself the slots back without actually... Getting them back, you know. Mm-hmm. So I see you, you guys all have a long rest, uh, uh, and you make your way towards uh, the tower. Uh, I need everybody to make me a survival or a nature check. Okay, survival or nature. What am I better at? Survival. <laughs> I'm asking myself. Twenty-four again. <laughs> Five. Please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me. Oh! Sweet! Jack is a city squirrel. They should not be here! All the city slickers did terribly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Praxin, Andi, and Broxigar, you all uh, are able to navigate your way through this mire uh, with ease. Uh, Beck and Ernest, uh, the two of you have some trouble. Um... But, uh, you know, apart yeah. from uh, almost losing your boot, uh, Ernest, at one point, uh, you are able to make it through relatively all right, though definitely not as clean as you were before. <laughs> I can see Ernest just fighting the mud, like, give me that boot back. Augustus. Oh, no. <laughs> anyway. I uh, sinking, like, the horse in, um... The five uh, of you. Story. The five of you. Uh, are traveling through the swamp. The five? Uh, Wait, hold on. Okay. There's, <laughs> oh, no. There's somebody missing. I gotcha. <laughs> what do I see when I turn back? Uh, you see a furred long arm long. sticking out of the mud. Oh, oh God. Uh, <laughs> get him, get him, get him. Okay, uh, oh, Prakin uh, will just try to pull out Augustus. Make me a strength, uh, a strength check. Okay. Nope. 16. Uh, you pull, and Augustus is not moving. Oh my Did god. I help? Yeah, Augustus is like, Augustus is about 400 pounds with his gear. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay uh, but I think I want to try. Yeah. And that, right. and that fur is going to get heavy. <laughs> I'm going to help. I'm, I'm going to help Broxagon. Absolutely. Both of you make me strength checks. We're both, we're both strong boys. That should be good. That's a strength save. Uh, Wait, is it just a flat oh, strength? strength? Uh, I will allow you to. I will allow you to use athletics, Proxy. Okay. Um. Okay, strength check. There we go. The both of you are pulling, and he begins to rise out of the mud, but uh, he's too stuck. Uh, come, come back on, and try again. Yeah. Unfortunately, a, a 27 uh, is not quite enough. Hey, Kay? Yes. Is there any trees nearby? Yes, there are lots of trees. Okay. We're gonna make a pulley system. Everybody give me your rope. I don't have a rope on me, do I? Wait, what do you mean you don't have rope on you? Everybody has rope on them. Over my 50 feet of rope. I don't have rope on me. Oh my fucking god. Anyway. <laughs> Uh, Beck takes the, 
Uh, Beck is gonna take the rope, go to like the nearest tree, find the the thickest the, the thickest branch and make a pulley system out of it. Absolutely, I'll allow you, I'll allow you to make a simple pulley system out of that. Heck yeah! All right. Um, Beck is gonna throw like a loop, uh, like one end down to um one of them da- down there, and they tie it to his hand or something. Try and get it around his shoulder. Shoulder? How much of his arm can we see? His elbow. So we can only go up yeah, to the get it to, I, well, get like, to try, the uh, try, try like digging down in the mud a little bit. It, it, around like the thickest part of his arm. <laughs> he sinks Doing another the, inch. Uh, the, the Terminator thumps. <laughs> uh, Augustus, make me a constitution saving throw. Oh no. Guys, we gotta get him out of here. Constitution? Uh, you are able to wow. continue holding your breath. Oh, thank God. All right, we got to get him out of here. Yeah, let's... Or this will start digging. Let's pull again. Oh, um, question about my lay on hands. You said they don't... Like, our, my cap is lowered as long as I'm in the island. Do yes. they go back up after you remove that gem? You gained three. Oh, wait, hold on. Back, we can't back to use the maze hand. Try and get him out. You could. Mage Hand can't. can't he can only lift much. so much, though. <laughs> yeah. Not Mage Hand it's can not gonna help like here. Five, five he, can li- he can lift 10 pounds. Yeah, oh. that, that's yeah, gonna do not nothing. Uh, to him. Okay. So, what are you guys no. all doing? Is the rope tied to Augustus? Or do we still need to get that tied up? Y- you've got it tied. Okay. Right. Someone so, said uh, that they tied it so do we all just try applying strength? To pull him out through the rope. Yeah. And then on the yeah. other side of the rope, everybody just fucking pull. Okay, Absolutely. Uh, everybody that's pulling, make me a strength or an athletics check at advantage. Advantage. I'm gonna do athletics. Athletics. Fuck, I'm doing terrible. Why are we doing so bad? Oh, 17. That's with that. Oh, oh. 17. Oh, they got 14. Yeah, you know what? Athletics. I just. I just hope no one gets really angry about the oh, situation and oh, becomes oh. stick in the mud. 19. Wow, Ernest. Wow. Uh, let's see. 14, 28. Oh, strong boy. 45, 48, 58, 67. Absolutely. Uh, you guys uh, heave ho mightily and with a slurp. Uh, Augustus is brought out of the mud, uh, coated, matted to the extreme. Uh, he looks like the bog man. <laughs> so, uh, I'm going to look. I'm going to look at uh, at uh, Augustus deep in the eyes and just go. Now you feel what I felt when I wasn't to the deep, when I wasn't to the moat. <laughs> No, you, you know. Now you know. Now you know. My brain. Oh, abs- uh, make me an uh, arcana check. <laughs> All right. Here you go, buddy. Let's hope this works. 19! Oh, wow. Oh, absolutely. Uh, Beck, like, snaps her finger, and Augustus, all the mud sloughs off of Augustus, and you are sparkling clean. Yay! So, uh, how, I saved uh, how him. are you doing, bu- how are you doing, buddy? How'd that happen? So, you know how I know it, 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 it's mucky. I think, uh, I think they stepped in the same, like, the bog crack that I almost lost my boot, my, my boot in. Wait, do I still have boots on? Because no, Beck I, I, is from the Golden Marshes, wouldn't they know that boot? there's, like, uh, there's, like, wet spots in marshland? You would. Yeah, there, uh, um, you probably, uh, uh, probably stepped into, like, a, a really wet spot. <laughs> uh, and right. with you being, um, heavy, <laughs> you went, whoop. Those were expensive boots. <laughs> I cleaned you up. Oh, no, his boots are gone. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, I don't like, think. reaching into the mud, like, feeling around. No. <laughs> You feel nothing. Oh. Uh, actually, you feel something, and you go to pull it up. It's a jawbone. Oh. 
<laughs> and we're walking, and we're walking. Uh, no way. It's uh, actually kind of, quite large. Yeah, what kind of jawbone? You pull it out, and it appears to be the jawbone of a long neck. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. wow. Let's, uh, let's try to keep moving, and, um... Can, like, Let's uh, try to stay on solid ground as much yes. as we can. Can Beck and Praxen like uh, lead the way and try and find like more solid dry spots of marsh? Absolutely. Oh, wait, wait. Um, can I speak the command word of the boots and try to get them to fly? What? Oh. <laughs> yeah, these are winged boots. <laughs> <laughs> so, genius. So you speak the command word. Uh, nothing seems to happen. Eventually, a bubble just kind of pops uh, from the mud, <laughs> but that's about all that happens. Uh -huh. <laughs> I, 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 I start like uh, you know, like when you do like you try to run in like waist height in like a waist high pool. You see like a like a slosh as you walk. I'm doing that. I want, I'm getting to that bubble. No, 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 no. No, no like the gone. bubble, like the bubble popped on the surface, as the though it rose gone. up from deep below. The boots uh, are gone. Like, sort of, is, I, I, like I, if he reaches into the mud, he should be able to grab it. We just gotta make sure he doesn't yeah. fall in. I, I speak the command word again and start reaching around in the mud. You... I made him his boots. <laughs> Make me an investig a hard investigation check. Investigation. <sighs> uh, come on. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Buddy! Those boots are gone. <laughs> Those boots were made for sinking. And that's just what they'll do. <laughs> Broxiga, or, uh, Augustus, sorry. Uh, Augustus, you grip your boots. Slorp, and you're sucked back into the mud. <laughs> <laughs> okay, get that. We never, we never, we never took down the boots. Do I have the boots, do I have the boots, though? Uh, they are in your hand. Uh, do we, we, did not, we did not take the rope out, so okay, we the, can uh, pull it. Okay, and gotcha. Your bare feet are the only thing sticking out of the mud. <laughs> Kill the okay. brand. Uh, so now we got. Oh my god. Okay, so tie around one of his feet. Yep. Alright, uh, again, boys! Okay, <laughs> athletics, athletics from everyone. Strength or athletics at advantage. <laughs> DC at 50. Advantage. 22. Athletics! Absolutely, I don't. Helpful. I don't even need to calculate that. You guys are able to pull him back up. You are just fucking yoinking the cord. Augustus, Augustus, make me a strength or athletics check. <laughs> oh, he's gonna oh, lose no. his gloves. <laughs> They're gone. Come on, let them go. <laughs> what it? Oh well. They yeah. were Gucci. <laughs> My Gucci. <laughs> My drip. Come on, let him <laughs> <be> on it. <laughs> the boots. With a twelve. You, you were able to retain one boot. <laughs> this is cruel and unusual punishment. With I think it's funny. Did you again? That yes. that one. And I, do I have to do Arcana again? Yes, make me an Arcana check. 18. Absolutely. You're uh, clean again, but I'm not clean, doing this if you fall in again. And you have one boot. <laughs> I will One. say that uh, in the event that you are in a place where magic works, they your singular boot will still work, but the flying speed is cut in half. Okay. <laughs> we gotta Wait, find our way back get... to civilization so we can like find a um find like Wait. a smith. So they can Wait, make we can just, another one. We could have just come back here after taking down the tower. And That's you could have spoken the command word. Are you sure? Okay, like are you sure that thing will be still in here? Or, like, not sunk deeper? Right you have a feeling that all of your, uh, Braxton and Beck, you have a feeling that all this activity probably made it sink deeper. 
Yeah, I think I think it's gone. Yeah. I'm sorry, buddy. I put I put I put I put a hand on. I got shot. Yeah, 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 that boot's gone, man. And this is like uh upside down shoulder. And, and if you try to go for it again, we, and if you try to go for it again, they will not. There probably won't be enough of you to pull from. <laughs> um, I, I is the boot clean from the presentation? Yes. Yes. Okay, I I, I put the boot. In my in my bag in my bag. Ejected. Uh, hey guys, let's uh let's take down the rope and get out of here. Cause I the more we you mess with like wet uh wet mud and sinkholes, the bigger it gets. So let's like pack up and get out of here. Yeah, come on, one okay. wing. Come on, one winged angel. Let's get out of here. <laughs> when the party's greatest enemy is a sinkhole. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> All right, let's take down the rope, let's get everybody's rope back, and let's get the fuck out of here. With <laughs> Beck and Braxton leading the charge, keeping uh, things like, relatively like. Okay, to the tower. <laughs> I didn't like even remember that you had magic boots. I just was taking your boots. Yeah. <laughs> fuck around and find out, I guess. Oh, fuck a, to fuck around as human to find to out find his divine. divine. <laughs> Ballin', but at what cost? Alright, let's get the fuck out of here before the sinkhole actually tries to eat us. Yeah, oh, no. let's get out. Ooh, actually, that's a good idea. Hold second on, verse, same as the first, kind of like get this magic crystal and GTFO. Come on, Sephiroth, let's get going. <laughs> Alright. Anyway, <clears throat> fuck is Sephiroth? <laughs> One wing and points at the single boot. You guys uh, are able to safely make your way to the tower. Okay, you gotta move the token, our party token. Ah. Oh my god. Goodbye, <laughs> my precious. <laughs> Goodbye, you fuck. You, you look, if you fuck look, valiantly. Look, if any, if any, if there's any luck. There could be a chance you find like another magic black, like magic shop or magic blacksmith, and you could probably buy another pair or buy yeah, another exactly. Or maybe who knows? Maybe someone with enough magic expertise could just duplicate. I don't know. Maybe like copy paste and just flip it. Hey, too bad artificers don't exist yet. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, well, I mean, uh, P uh, Pierre Mantle is on his way to become one. <laughs> This reminds me, the next time we find civilization, I need to get- I need to buy, like, a pol uh, pulley system. <laughs> yes, a block and tackle uh, is a cheap item. A block item. and tackle. <laughs> I need- I need to- I- Uh, I'm gonna write that down in my, um... In my character- my character chat. Buy block and tackle. <laughs> <laughs> so, with, with just the one- the one flying boot, I imagine Augustus having to use it like a hoverboard. Oh my god. <laughs> and just like, just the, the, the non, the non boot just sort of like, kicking in the air. Or, no, you're just or... constantly, like, you know how figure skaters go on one foot? Yeah, it's <laughs> constantly like that. <laughs> Before you is a massive lake. Uh, the water is brown and sludgy. Oh, this, yes. this, this brings back memory. And in the middle, you see a pristine white tower. Is it like is it like the one from Isma? Uh, not Isma Armat. Yes, it is a fifty foot tall white marble tower with arrow slits at the top and purple light coming out from it. Are there any? Is there like a bridge leading this one, or is it just surrounded by a swamp? Uh, there is no bridge. Okay. Paradise. Now you can get some use out of your ring. <laughs> It doesn't work. <laughs> doesn't shit. I'll begin taking off my armor. No. Uh, you know what? I'll just, wait, I'll hold just on, trudge hold on through is, the slime. Is there anything around the path you can use to just see how deep it is? There's plenty of branches. Uh, yeah, I'll just grab a branch and I'll just poke it and just stick it into the into the muck and see how far down it goes. Well, the water only goes down a couple inches. Uh, but your branch keeps sinking and sinking and sinking into muck. Uh, hmm. So it's a layer of water and then uh, the layer of mud underneath. Yep. Hey, Broxagar, race you there? What? 
I'm All flying. Right. Are you guys sure you want to do that? It's a swimming contest. Mom taught me how to swim. Is there enough water to be even to swim in? Or is it just, is it like standing water? Uh, there's like two inches. <laughs> okay, yeah, standing water. Uh, Beck, would you like to fly again? Yes, please. Cool, we fly. Man, it's too bad no one has a pair of flying boots. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, you know what? Uh, I'll I'll bring out the winged boot. I'll put it on, and I will will hoverboard. I will hoverboard my way up. <laughs> oh, no. oh. oh wait, wait! I'm gonna put my water walking ring just in case. I'm I'm just gonna start running. <laughs> wait, what's uh, the oh, speed on the winged boots? Ernest, you're like it. It's funny because. Every every time you take a step, you're like, yeah, I'm walking on water until your foot like sinks down into two inches of mud. Uh, and it's, no, but it should be like. And it's issues. only it's only the second of pressure that you have on your next foot on the water that allows you to pull it out. So it, it, it's uh, almost like it's almost like when you're walking through really deep snow with a layer of ice on top. Yeah, kind of. Uh, wait, wait, Angel. It's just like that ricochet thing. Mm -hmm. Um. You have floating shields, right? I do have an animated shield. Oh shit, but it's you magic. Could that. I don't think it's gonna work in the anti-magic zone. Well, mm. my ring of water walking is like, somewhat My thought working. was, activate your magic shield, have it float. Have it just stand on your shield and float. And float. Yeah, I don't think it carries people. Oh, but man. you could still use it as a surfboard, though. Exactly. Oh, um, right. Fax is just gonna uh, stay back and just like watch guard to make sure nothing like <laughs> of notice would like shut like just to let know if there's any danger. We are so, we will be right back. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. So how the much... wing it... Oh, go. <laughs> so uh, single. Uh, seeing as the winged boots just used your walking speed for flight speed, I'll just say it's difficult terrain to fly. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Augustus, you begin slowly figure skating your way to the tower. Uh, Andy sprouts her angelic wings and is carrying uh, Beck. Uh, Ernest and Broxigar are having a swimming race? Uh, no, I'm not I'm just going. Sprinting. Oh, you're not going? Okay. No. Uh, so Ernest is going over. Yeah, I'm just sprinting. And you guys are all <laughs> able to get there fairly easily. Um, yeah. Who is grabbing the gem? Probably um, Beck, because I think the people who can get over there the fastest are Beck and I, simply because I'm not encumbered by, like, swimming, and I don't have difficult terrain. <laughs> I'm not swimming, I'm running. It's like two inches of water and then mud. Uh, do you round up for for difficult terrain? Uh, rounding round... always rounds down for D&D &D 5e. Yeah. Okay. Um, you, uh, can I see the crystal? Absolutely. There's another uh, pinkish purplish crystal pulsating in the middle. I am going to look through the... Um through the window and try and yoink it again with my mage hand. Absolutely, make me an arcana check. Yes. Finally, I get to use mage hand in this game. <laughs> I just get to carry people while flying. Aww. I think this is really fucking cool. Wow. God damn it, people fuck up. <laughs> Unfortunately, you are not able to push out your spell. Uh, it's not working this time, Andy. I think we gotta go in. <laughs> Can you try again? Or is, it, is that... Ernest, but... <laughs> yep. you make your way to uh, the bottom of the tower. Cool. And <laughs> you mm, you see something oh. in the oh, no. ground floor of the tower. There I are mean, three mounds of mud, each holding a singular white object. Uh... Uh, mm, that's so tempting. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Uh, I'm going. Uh, can I try to walk past that first? Oh, absolutely. You can walk past them and go up the stairs. Uh, 
I'm gonna yoink one of these white objects and then gun it up the stairs. <laughs> Absolutely. Ernest, add a nightmare egg to your inventory. Oh my god! Oh no! Oh, you have you could pretend you have a dino buddy, or you could have an angry parent on your hand. Can't rent. They're packed. They're packed. No, nothing. Nothing. Nightmares don't. Are nightmares not hunters, or nightmares just like hunt so long? You don't know. Oh yeah, fair. Oh yeah, we don't know. Uh, Prashen just called to back. Hey, Ernest is making his way up. You gonna let them get there before you? Do I get there before Beg gets another mage in? You, you see, you know, you know, competition. I mage hand again. You know, competition worked last time. Yeah. Uh, Ernest, you will get there as uh, Beck is failing the first mage hand. While all this is happening, Roxigar and Praxin. Oh. Yes. Mm. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Oh god. You both are waiting on the uh, on the shore. And you hear a rolling call. Oh no. Oh fuck. I need you guys to roll initiative. Fun. Oh, that's um, great. That's great. <laughs> oh, no. oh, it's just the two. It's just the two. Of us. It's oh, just fun. the two of you guys. Just, just the, two the two of us. us. <laughs> we can make it if we try. Just Eleven. the two of us. Nine. <laughs> brain cell. Why? Why should be a nightmare? It's a nightmare. God damn it. But it's the daytime. Oh, God. Yeah, and this is a nest. <laughs> what? Well, I got a character. Yeah, I got a character. N neither person or Braxton probably know that there are eggs in there, so we just see nightmares out here. <laughs> Braxton, you see three heads poking out of the bush. Looking at you. Hmm. Ooh. I don't know if I want to move because and they clearly well it, we're technically equally numbered, but like equal to numbered, but like they have the lay of the land, and then like. Hmm. Yes, but I'm much stronger than all of them, so... Yeah, you're much, you're, much, thick you're, much stronger and, you're much stronger and beefier, but they have sheer bigger. numbers and they are yeah. fast as fuck. I, He's bigger. I can see them down around here, too. Okay, He's so, the first um... Member of the okay. <laughs> so, I... Hmm. Hmm. All the words of a great Let me check rock cigar, too. I'm gonna hold. I'm gonna hold my turn until the nightmares go, just to see what they do. Okay. B R Oxygar, he goes I'm... really, really far. What? Uh, what exactly are you holding? Because you can only hold an action. You can't hold your turn. Hmm. <laughs> Hearing the badink and seeing Coda's mouth open is hilarious. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold my attack to see what they do. Okay. What are you guys' passive perceptions? Uh, my passive... everyone's or no, just those uh, two. Uh, okay, minus fifteen. Minus sixteen. This one. This one disappears into the bush. Oh, oh, fuck. These two appear to be attempting to uh, hide, uh, but you are able to see them. Rock 
Roxigar. Uh, you can, you, you both can see uh, these two slinking uh, forward. I'm gonna step forward and I'm gonna take the dodge action. Okay. And then just have a uh, uh, black razor ready. The bonk. The bonk. All right. Braxton. Okay. I think the one fight could be to death me, so, uh. Uh, hmm. Obviously, the smart, the smart thing to do would not be to stray far away from Braxigar, but obviously not stay too close. I'm gonna move over here, uh, and I assume Mavic will follow me. Okay. And I will take aim, and I will begin to take aim at the one on the far right. Okay. Uh, oh, cat, can I, uh, do I have to do an arcana check to try and catch Hunter's Mark? Yes. Okay, I will try and do that. Arcana, let's go. Nat 20! Oh, absolutely. Uh, you oh, managed to place your Hunter's Mark on, uh, this nightmare. Okay, and now I will try and take aim, and I'll take aim and fire my longbow. Absolutely. Okay, first attack. 23. Uh, 23 absolutely hits. Uh, second attack, 19. Yep, definitely uh, hits. And then Hunter's Mark damage, 5, so 5, 8, 13, 18, 18 damage. Absolutely. You sink you Hunter's Mark for both the attacks. Wait, they both hit, right? Yeah, they, they both do. hit. Yeah, so thought, you get thought, Hunter's I... Mark damage on both the attacks. Ah, yes, you do. Oh, cool. Did not know that until now. Anyway, uh, anyway, uh, last hunter's mark. That is an extra five. So, 23. Absolutely. You slam two barbed arrows into this creature's shoulder, and you actually, it actually stumbles, uh, and lets out a low hiss at you, but it definitely looks shaken by that attack. Get his ass! <laughs> this, you see none of this. You're busy in a tower with one of the babies. <laughs> I know, but the player is cheering. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, okay. Is there anything else you'd like to do in your turn? Uh, nothing. Uh, let me see. Is there anything you'd like Maverick to do? Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see. Oh yes, absolutely. Maverick is gonna take that opportunity and run up to and run up to the nightmare. Absolutely. And, a, and attempt to and attempt to uh an attempt to go with a uh, go for a claw attack. Absolutely, make me your attack. Okay. Oh wait, no. Is that the is that the good is that the attack roll or is that? Oh no, that's the attack roll. Is yep, that a thirteen? That's the attack roll. Uh, a thirteen. Thank you, roll twenty for destroying the character sheet. Uh, a thirteen does hit. Oh cool. Uh, so what do I roll for damage? Uh, click the oh, attack wait. button. Oh, click the attack. Oh duh. Uh, that will be eleven slashing damage, and on the target, uh, on hit. The target must make a con save of DC 13. On a failure, it is now bleeding and will lose 5 HP at the start of every turn. Maverick will... charges okay. forward and leaps, extending its claw out and eviscerates this nightmare. Coils of organ falling out from the <laughs> rent in its stomach as Maverick tears into it. Well, Maverick eating good tonight. <laughs> Bon appetit! <laughs> I'm just afraid of what can happen to me now because the one that I'm <laughs> hitting. It saw me. It must have saw me fire at it. It must have saw me. We'll, we'll get that when we get that because it's attacking. It's turn is next. Yes. 
on their turn. Oh, this one is going to continue circling around Brock Cigar. Brock Cigar, it's your turn. Oh god, that one's still waiting. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that's 30 feet to get exactly to it. Uh, and I'm going to take an attack on it. Absolutely. 25 to hit? Yep. That's... Uh, let me re-roll that one on the die. Uh, well, 14 points of slashing damage and actually another 7. So 21 points of slashing damage and I needed to make a, a dexterity saving throw DC 16. Alrighty. Where's its strength? Let me double check. I like to think that Practice may have had like a, a bit of like. Saving throw. DC 16. Uh, it fails. Alright, I knock it prone. And then I will take another attack at it with Black Razor. Absolutely. Uh, 22 to hit. Yep. Black Razor eating good tonight. Uh, let me reroll that one on the die. So that's 18 points of slashing damage. The sentient companions are eating good. You hear <laughs> a purr of pleasure in your mind as this creature's soul is sucked into the fanged maw of, of Black Razor. Okie dokie. I, I like to imagine any time Black Razor eats a soul, it makes the Minecraft eating sound. <laughs> no. Good. 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 Another soul to feast upon. <laughs> oh, you good? And initiative is dropped. I wonder if that other nightmare just went for the tower. Funny you should mention that. I should yeah, have it did. That. Yes! <laughs> I think it did because there's the eggs, so. Yep. Mm, it would worry about the babies. <laughs> if I'm yoinking the gem. <laughs> Listen, if we could take. The two of us can take two of those. The rest of them can take one. Oh yeah, they, oh yeah, that'd be fine. Maybe. <laughs> Probably. God, really it's just getting brutally mauled by a fucking nightmare. Uh, mi uh, meanwhile, uh, I want to. I, I I would. Hmm. I want to say maybe. Hmm. I'm trying to see what would do because I feel like Mavic would just be tearing into it, just eating <laughs> if recent kill. So like. Practice may not want to try and like try and take any pride off of like a claw or anything because it's in the process of like getting eaten. Hey, I need the four of you, Ernest, yeah. Beck, Andy, and Augustus to roll initiative. Yay! Let's go! Let's fucking go! Let's go! It'll be fine. I'm the slowest mother. Damn, Ernest, keep up. Ah, uh, never mind. I'm not this. <laughs> What's Damn everybody's squirrel. passive perception? Uh, uh, passive. uh, 13. 13. I think mine is just 10. Ooh. On day. Yeah, just 10. You're holding Beck up. Uh, you see Ernest get to the top. Uh, you feel something's wrong. Fun, but got you're it. Not sure what? Uh, should did would Practice or Practice go try and call out to anyone in the, at the tower? Like, uh, they might, or would they be too far away to hear? This is happening simultaneously. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh. So as we're fighting the two, they are currently going with. Okay, fine. I gotcha. Gotcha. Yes, <laughs> your soul is mine, Black Razor 2022. 
<laughs> Your soul is mine. Your soul is forfeit. Die, die. Oh. Thank you for the self-care check, Nick. You, you fool. Now your life is forfeit. You fool. Ah. You absolute coward. Okay. <laughs> is there anything you'd like to do? Um, I think I'm going to shove back through the window. <laughs> so that my hands are full. Aren't, aren't full. Um. Okay. Here, hold this. <laughs> so, it, was that an action or was that like a free object in or because of how tight the window is, I would say it would take your action just because of how, like, it would take a good couple seconds to push back through. Okay. I'm just seeing Beck get squeezed in, like, uh, scrap the then squirrel. I'm, because I can sense that something's wrong, I'm gonna try and, uh, figure out what it is. I have to imagine that Beck going through the window like a, like the classic rubber chest and then. Boop. Or so, what would I? Roll me ha. a perception check. Okay. Twenty-three. Oh, oh, wow. With a twenty-three, you see a tail entering the door of the tower and slipping through. Ooh. Uh, okay, <laughs> then I'm gonna use my movement to get the fuck down there. Leaving me up here. <laughs> You're in the window, you're fine! Okay! Now, Andy. Oh. Yeah, okay, hi. You land down here at the door. Okay. Door. 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 And, and you see door. three shapes slinking <gasps> towards oh, the staircase. God, Oh god, there's more. Oh, there's always more. Oh, thank god. Can my bonus action be just screaming bloody murder? Uh, it is a free action to scream. Yeah, but the scream I have in mind might take a little longer. It is a free action to scream. <laughs> Got it. It is a very high pitched GET THE FUCK DOWN HERE! Scream. <gasps> oh god. Uh, fuck, 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 fuck. Do I have a bonus action? Do I have a bonus action spell? Shit, fuck, fuck, shit. Sorry, that's a lot of swearing. Uh, I apologize. Do you, do you yeah, how dare you fucking with... swear on my goddamn stream? What this is a child friendly with... fucking stream. Yeah. What the fuck what the is wrong fuck with you? Andy? Don't you know how many 10 year olds <laughs> watch my shit? <laughs> I, hope, I, hope, I, hope, I hope you know. Okay, you know what? Server? Come on. Wait, did you catch the attention of the. Uh... Of the nightmares by making that high pitch scream. Yes. Uh, they already saw me. I don't think there's much I could have done to you. Oh know. no, they didn't. They, they weren't. Did. They were just walking away from you. They weren't looking at you. <laughs> oh, oh my no. mistake. Now, now they're all looking <laughs> at you. Now. now they know you're there. <laughs> well, um, I'm going to uh. Fuck. Where to go? Wait, are the eggs? Shield are of the... faith. Okay. It's. Oh. Casting time of one uh, bonus action, so I'm just gonna put that in there so people can see what I'm doing. <laughs> I might have the two humor of a 12 year old, but alas, not that young. Dude. Um, I don't know why I put spell save on there, but uh, me and a creature of my choice. Uh, the egg. <laughs> uh, it's you, and yeah. it's you or a creature of your choice. Oh. Well, it's a creature of your choice, in which could be you. Okay, then it's me, and then I need to do an Arcana, yeah? Yep. 14? Uh, a 14 is not enough. For a level 1? For a level 1 spell, inside of the tower. <laughs> but I'm not inside yeah. the tower, I'm outside. Still. You oh, are close okay. enough. You are close enough to the tower. You are literally against the wall. <laughs> oh, I thought... Oh, has Ernest not to yank the crystal out? No, Ernest, like, just got up there. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cool. Sounds good. Alrighty. That's it. Okay, question. Yes. Uh, where are the eggs? On the... On the map? Oh, um... Where would the eggs be? Would they be behind the nightmares, or, like, behind Andy? Uh, these are the three nests. Um... And you currently 
have one. Yeah, I already have one, but like, what about the two others, you know? Uh, yeah, I have a just... feeling that you plucking them up was the reason they're here in the first place. Oh, duh. They're, they're nesting ground, of course it is. Nah, <laughs> you're crazy. Throw <laughs> their egg at them. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, because that'll go over super well. There. There's the staircase. Uh, there's the three nests, and the two purple things are the, are the remaining eggs. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I have a welcome uh, employee down there. Uh hmm. How high in the air am I? Thirty feet. Thirty feet? Um could I deactivate my boot and then reactivate it as <laughs> as I near the ground and then just sort of like hop off? Are Make you me a uh, you can with a with a DC ten duck save. Deck save? Okay. Are you trying to... Oh, absolutely. You? you pull this off flawlessly. Superhero right. landing. <laughs> Superhero landing. Uh, and then I'll rush over to Andy. And I'll just sort of, like, uh, hate scooch out of the way. And... Okay. Uh, can I barge through that nightmare? Through the what? Uh, through the nightmare. Um... Just sort of... And just sort of stand on the other side. Oh yeah, no, you can move like. Eh, I'll say you can you can move through their space. Uh, well, because you can like move between them because there's that like angular, um, yeah. thing there. Also, you're taller than her, so you can reach over her. Yeah. Uh, and <laughs> what? I still have an action after that, or is that is that just movement? Uh, it is not an action to activate the boots, so yes, you still have your action. Okay. Uh, I will stab the first guy with my spear. Uh, absolutely. A 21 Ooh. definitely hits. Okay. Uh, cause I, and I have multi-attack, because I am a level 5. 20 absolutely hits. First hit, uh, 9... Uh, yeah, nine damage, person, and then twelve person. Uh, let's see, Tom. Uh, you hit this thing twice with your spear, and you do feel a little bit. Uh, you do see uh, a small spark come off of it to to hit the creature. Um. Little this middle teasing. one is not looking good. Uh, and as a bonus action, I'm just gonna, like, smack it with the other end of my spear. <laughs> Hold on, master. 17. Absolutely. Wow. Uh, 8 damage. Uh, yes. You crack this one's skull, and it dies. Uh, oh boy, and how are the other two gonna respond? I can't believe I forgot I have the bonus action he hit for like three sessions. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll end my turn. Alrighty. <clears throat> oh, oh wait, did you roll? For, did Nick you roll has... initiative for the dino? For the what? Did you roll initiative for the dino? Yeah. They still have the I same don't... initiative from before. Uh, uh, I didn't see my turn order. So. <laughs> shit. <laughs> That's right. It fuck it. It fucks off whenever you like change fucking maps. Ah, uh, okay. Um, keep panic to the pile. Hold on, let's go up. Uh, keep panic to the pile already. I oh yeah, I think I think the initial was a nine. Ah uh, yeah, it was a nine. Yeah, it was yeah. nine. Okay, okay. Alrighty. Ernest, you hear the sounds of battle and hissing and roaring from the ground floor, but the crystal is right in front of you. I am and, not and staying. I'm not staying in here longer. I'm. Can I yoink the crystal as I pass by to go grab? Uh, to go grab Beck. I no, will say it. it is a bonus action to grab the crystal. Yeah, I will use the bonus action to grab the crystal. Absolutely. As I pass by. Make me. Yep, no. 
Uh, you grab the crystal, and it attunes to you. Oh. Everyone can feel the magical pressure lightning. And Ernest, yeah. you gained the knowledge of a new spell as you oh. receive the Demiplane Crystal. Oh. Oh. You know what? You can have that. I got what I wanted. You have an EMP. It has the yeah, same I know. properties. Yeah, I know. Where it has 10 charges. Nope. Oh. <laughs> it has 10 charges. <laughs> Yoink bag. And can cast the spell Demiplane with 10 charges. It regains one spell or one charge per day. Oh shit! What did dummy plane do? You uh, create a shadowy door on a flat, yeah. solid surface that you can see within range. The door is large enough to allow medium creatures to pass through. When opened, the door leads to a demi plane that appears to be an empty room of thirty feet in each dimension, uh, in each dimension made of wood or stone. When the spell ends, the door disappears, and any creatures or objects inside are trapped there as the door oh. disappears. Each time you cast this spell, you can create a new demiplane or connect to a previous one that you created. Additionally, oh. if you know the nature and con contents of a demiplane created by this spell by another creature, you can connect to it. Oh. Oh, shit. So, you know, so you can al what you can also do is make it a interdimensional closet. I could. You put your but... shit in the closet. So, <laughs> you know, but like you do so have er to be careful that you don't lock yourself in the interdimensional closet. So Ernest gets a pocket dimension room, and Beck gets a magical nullification pulse. I don't get a pocket dimension room. I get as many pocket rooms as I want. <laughs> within, no, within reason, with the dream. With <laughs> within reason? No, yeah. every time. You every, ten days. Yeah, every ten days. Yeah, every ten days. days. Stop moving, I'm There's typing. Class. There can only be access oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. An interdimensional closet that can only be accessed once every 10 days. Can yeah. imagine, you just can imagine you put something away okay. and you can be like, ah, uh, uh, fuck, I must have needed it, but you still you know, have a complete charge. <laughs> Let's hope what you put in there you don't need real soon. Anyway. So it is. I, mean, I can just put a person in there, so. Yes, you have the rest of your turn, Ernest. Grab me. Yeah, I'm going to help Beck get, go through the window. Help me. Like, finish going through the window, like, pop it out. Just... Like, you know, like, you know how Wayne the Pooh is kind of, like, you're stuck in, like, that one hole? Yeah. Uh, yeah. At the end of the movie? Like, it's just, like, Beck on the other side, like, doing grabby hands. Grabby hands? <laughs> like, how are you doing, Scrat? <laughs> I heard Andy screaming, let's get out of here! I know, I heard that too. Let's go down the stairs. Would Beck notice the egg? No, I would Did... be focusing on the big crystal. Okay. Ernest just goes, hey, I nabbed this, by the way, and shows the egg. That doesn't look like a crystal, let's get out of here. <laughs> Beck only egg. has eyes for shiny things. Eggs, <laughs> not so much. But if it's not shaped, then you <laughs> an egg isn't nut shaped. No, well, I mean, it is acorn. It is, it is acorn shaped, but without the cap. <laughs> no, Surreal. Not. Where would you like these head? One for each of the rest. Alrighty. Oh wow. Oh, oh that's a head for me. each of us. Thank you. Uh, I get a head. Ernest just stares at Peck and just goes. Yeah, but think of the omelets. <laughs> Our, Our head, head pets. Come. pets. <laughs> Our <laughs> head pets. <laughs> not right now. <clears throat> not right now. To no. Not topical. No, no. Anyway, die now. Beck. Yes. Uh, Beck, it is your turn. Beck, think of the yeah. omelets. <laughs> um. <laughs> I'm gonna uh, take my movement to come. Like, is it like an open place, or is like the stairs go down to a new room? The stairs go down to a new room, uh, and All it right. is fifty feet to get down to the bottom floor. Well, luckily enough, I have enough. <laughs> For some reason, I have fifty-five movement speed. 
I know I have some of that from the squirrel and some of that from a boon. Anyway. <laughs> I use my bonus action to activate, um, my Shadow Blade. <laughs> Alrighty. And my, um, normal action to cast, um, Firebolt. I don't have enough room to get to the... Well, actually, wait. It's 50, 50 feet to get down. To, like, right here? Yes? Yes. <laughs> Oh, I have an extra five feet. Hey, buddy! <laughs> <laughs> I just noticed the little tech that says tiny lava pool. Yeah. <laughs> Make me an arcana check, Beck. <laughs> ah, yes, I forgot about that. All right. Ten. You are just barely able to push through this spell. All right, oh, no yeah. crystal. Oh, yeah, crystal remove. Yeah! Mm -hmm. All right, and then I hit with rapier. I hit with sword. Wait, I thought you were casting ah! Firebolt. No, I changed. I changed it because I was able to. Oh, then you didn't. Need, then you didn't need to make a check, but in that one, um. Well, I still had to make the check to activate um. Shadow Blade. Ah, uh, you hit the creature. However, it uh it reacts and bites you back. Oh, oh no! Hold uh, up, let me add the Shadow Blade. There you go. You, uh, you feel like this creature is immensely, you see that it is immensely hurt. Uh, the, your shadow blade, the injury made by your shadow blade widening wider than it should be. Hey, but buddy. it does bite your arm. Ow, 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 <laughs> Uh, you take 23 slashing damage. Okay, that's nice. And you are now bleeding. Uh, that's an ouchie. Thankfully, we have healing kits. Is there anything else you'd like to do on your turn, Beck? I can't do anything else on my turn. Oh no, now it's there. <laughs> I, I literally use my bonus action, my movement, and my normal action. I don't have a reaction. All well, right. actually, technically I do, but I already pet. I already past the use of it. I can use my reaction to uh, for uncanny dodge. Actually, I have uncanny dodge. <laughs> yep, make sure you remember that next time. Next time. Yeah, it's a little too late for that, but for now, I cannot... Uh, I can't do anything else, so I end my turn. On their turn, uh, this one charges forward. They each pick up an egg in their mouth. And they egg. run out of the tower. Break the eggs. <laughs> How very smart. You all will get an opportunity attack if you want to. Uh, uh, Absolutely. Break the eggs. Even Ernest, even though Ernest is like no, on No, Ernest level? does not. He's on a different level. Okay. Yeah, I'm like on the, uh, on the upside. Yeah. That's a net one. Ooh. Oh, no. <laughs> Uh, e unfortunately, you do miss. Oh, wow. Oh. Andy, absolutely. Um, which one were you attacking? Um, the second one that ran out. Alrighty. Roll me damage. At seven bludgeoning. And wait, hold on, I'm not done. Um... <laughs> I'm making sure uh, that I don't miss anything. Um, do, 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 um, extra. Okay, so, and then it's gonna take an extra eight radiant damage. Alrighty. Uh, you smack this thing, and your the end of your staff glows bright uh, as you hit it, and it stumbles a bit, but it is still running. Sweet. Damn, the egg didn't break. <laughs> and the opposite, Braxton. No way. I, no, I, I can't wait to see just practice for you. I, I, I have a thing in mind for practice reaction when he sees the egg. <laughs> uh, they disappear into uh, into the bush. Aww. And initiative is dropped. 
Okay. Congratulations, you guys attempted to murder uh, mothers trying to protect their babies. I know, I'm so proud. <laughs> We yeah, actually yeah. murdered yeah. one, though. Man, get, man, get, man, get on a level. Man. We both killed one. I had help from my dino buddy. Brasco, oh just guy. Hey, but look, I, uh, we killed one. I needed the bandage. I needed the healing. I give, I give you the healing. Give me uh, the healing. Uh, so can we, can we heal the old make our way out? Have, have seven lay on hand points. Oh, thank you. you gain, Do you need any more healing? Because I can... You gain seven hit points, and you are no longer bleeding. I would love some more healing if you're willing to uh, give it to me. So can we assume that um, I do. Out? I do healing hands. Um, I touch back, and they regain eight hit points. Absolutely. Yay. Can we assume that they're now out, uh, outside the tower? Yes, you, are, you all uh, um, are able to group back up. Uh, can Praxen see the egg that Ernest Depends. stole? Is Ernest, Ernest is just like, like carrying it like uh, two-handed. Ernest, what's yeah. that in your hand? Uh, it's a wire item. I I I found it in one of the piles of mud, and I was like, it, it was. Did you, were you were you fighting nightmares in there? There was nightmares. There was a dead one on the floor when you walked out. That wasn't oh. there when you walked in. <laughs> so you mean to tell me you took one of their young? I mean, Good if we you. bring it back to the scientist, we bring it back to uh, we bring it back to the scientists. They're going to be able to witness the birth of one, and I feel like How that would be pretty egg? cool for them. It's about the size of uh, Ernest's forearm. That's a pretty solid breakfast. It is. Yeah. It's an egg. Or, or we could get paid if we give it to the scientists for them to study. That's they what. That's what was my thought. That's what a we, genius what? idea, Praxen. I'm so glad you came up with it. <laughs> uh, is there anything? Is there anything <laughs> left of the corpse that I assume Mavic would just tear it into, like to just like take like a tooth or like a claw or something? There's not much left of that one. There is still the one that Broxigar killed. Uh, the but one that, that Augustus killed. But that, but that Broxigar kill and Praxigar's like, yeah, I'm not testing that one and I know what happened. <laughs> uh, uh, Ernest, honor... make me a deck save. Who, me? Yeah. Oh, oh no. fuck. <laughs> oh, no. I'm what? about to get swiped. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. So, Never Maverick... Maverick uh, goes to bite uh, and steal the egg from you. No! Uh, he swipes. Emma, what the fuck? Thank you for 100 bits. <laughs> oh, wait, do I not have a do I not have a bits message? Oh, shit, I need to, I need to make one. <laughs> I'm just going to um, at Maverick, like... Maverick just kind of, like, swipes the egg, uh... Oh, there it is. I do have one. It was just delayed. Okay. Uh, Maverick swipes the egg from you, and it's just kind of like, like, is like biting it, uh, but uh, it's uh, like can, not breaking. Uh, can practice be like, uh, no, 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 hand it, hand it here, hand it here. <laughs> no, no, no. What's give the it to last me. time you fed that thing? Just now. It just ate a whole. It just ate a whole corpse of one of the nightmares. Can I try to yoink it back? No, can I? Uh, can I try and make an animal hand and try to see if I can take the egg away? Uh, yes. I want a yoink it back. Okay. Speaking of corpses, how about dead XP? Ah. Yes. Nine. Yeah, that that thing's not moving. Uh, you're like you're like trying to pull it away from the thing, and it just keeps hissing at you and holding on to it. Um, I'm going to yoink it back. <laughs> oh no. Make me a uh strength check. And uh, Praxin, make me a strength check for Maverick. And check on Maverick. Okay. Fuck. Okay. Uh, Maverick. Please be lower. Please be lower. Please be lower. That's a twelve. Fuck. You are unable to pull the egg away <laughs> from him. <laughs> uh, could Praxin try and yoink it out, or did Praxin waste to trying to do like the animal handling? I'll say that with enough trying, you know, you guys are able to get it back from him. Uh, it takes Take it a back. hot minute though. Okay. Now, who had the egg? 
I do. Yoink. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, Brock Cigar could probably take it from Maverick. <laughs> you guys just sit there struggling. Brock Cigar just walks by. Oh, hey, neat. Yoink. <laughs> <laughs> My boy. How much do you think we can get for this? Uh, <laughs> honestly, I uh, have no idea. Uh, probably should not get less than the shell not bitten into. Oh, no, the shell's still fine. Oh, cool. So, who knows? Maybe. I don't know. They probably never had a live specimen to work with before, let alone a hashling. Hmm. I mean, they're, well, they're well, gonna well, find out. Well, after them we get back in worst case scenario, we just eat and not we just eat it and not tell them. Andy, you like eggs? You want to hold on to it? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I imagine it was like the Dolores no, like no. <laughs> <laughs> and with that that is where we are going to end tonight's session oh, hell yeah for two towers down baby for clearing the tower and killing three nightmares Ooh. you guys Ooh. gain 11,900 experience oh my God. that's a level up that is a level plus up. 9, yeah. 000, so, plus 11,000 what? 900. Nine. Oh, so 57,050? 57,050. Congratulations, you guys are now level 9. Oh, <gasps> yeah. Fucking yeah. finally! Level, level hey. 3 spell? Level That's three a 10 spell. for my hit points. Yes. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Hold up. This level, I get a roguish archetype. What do I get? What do I get? <gasps> Starting at level 9, when you're hidden from a creature and you cast a spell on it, the cr creature has disadvantage on any saving throws it makes! Yes! So, wait, do we roll d8 or d10 for health? Is it d8? It's based on it's your class. It's based on your class. You roll a d10 because you're a ranger. Oh, okay. Guys, 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 I feel the need- I feel like I need to tell you all this right now. I need- I- I have 69 health. Nice. I have 69 nice. max HP. Nice. Nice. Do not add any more HP. <laughs> this is it. This is the best she can do. This is the peak. Okay, I technically have 70 base health. I should also probably so figure now, out what so I Oh, now I would have 60. Uh, what? What? Did I get third level spells now. I get <laughs> fifth level spells and I Preston, am... what's your HP at? Uh... Technically, it should be 70, but because I'm attuned to that Coast Great Sword, it takes 10 off of that. So I'm sitting oh. at 60. I was like, damn, like that doesn't sound. 60 sounds low, but I forgot about the Great Sword. Yeah, I got that Great I got that Blood Curse Great Sword that I attuned to. I have yet to use, but I'm waiting for the right moment to use that. Uh -huh. Hi, Lily. Uh, you joined in right about at the end of the session. Yeah. <laughs> Lily, I'm sorry we that the second up. time. I I'm sorry. This is usually about how long the sessions last. I can't you, I can't stream too much later into the evening because of work. Yeah, me neither. Not gonna lie. Yeah, it's 4 a.m. for for, for, for I think it would have dipped at like 5 a.m. I think I got a talent for that. Yeah, but that's why we have the VODs channel on, on YouTube if you guys are interested at all. Um, um, which you should be. Fellas, fifth level spell. I can Y'all. <laughs> Y'all. I Hi. have never been more excited for a... Uh, spell in my life. Oh, I'm sorry for some of these spells. Flame strike. Flame strike. I knew it. It's such a good spell. Okay, so I get flame strike and scrying. Scrying. Excuse me. Oh no. Oh, scrying. No. Also mask your wounds too. Um, I am gonna go with greater restoration at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> ah yes, you finally get that spell. <laughs> uh yeah. Uh, if you guys are interested, um here is uh the VOD channel. Yeah. Um I don't have an upload schedule. Sometimes I literally forget until the day of where a stream is about to expire to upload it. Um 
oh well. <laughs> uh, but I have I have been uploading all of the Jade Wing sessions. <laughs> Um, I don't have much to add to my like level up, so I'm already done. <laughs> I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna dump my two level two spells that I never used and just go for level three spells now. I've got a new spell and an invocation oh, to choose. I can be oh, Jesus. I can water walk. Use a modifier. Y'all are really obligated to be interested in the mods channel. <laughs> oh, hi Waha. Waha is fucking left. <laughs> Thank you for the self care, Lily. The, pri the price to pay for being early on to go to streams. <laughs> oh, Waha, uh, Mr. Doom. I'm sorry, Waha. Alrighty, oh, wait, This was a wild session, so please, like, watch the VOD if you have the time. Yeah, please. It was it's a so good funny. session for roleplay. Augustus got stuck in his sinkhole. And I lost, lost his you. Gucci. I lost and my lost shoe. And lost his Balenciagas. I lose my Gucci. <laughs> my Gucci. Now, before oh, wait, we you lost your Yeezys. Oh. Oh, wait. <laughs> before we end tonight's stream, first, does anybody have any suggestions for raids? And second, Nick, I have to know where are you at, my gamer? In How many? One. Nick knows what I'm talking about. Where are you at, I'm gamer? I'm afraid. No, oh. no. How ma how many points do you have? Uh oh. 41k. We're almost there, gamers. Hey. Oh no. <laughs> so do I. The choosing. The choosing. <laughs> yes. Um, in fact, uh, anybody, anybody in chat who has 40k or more points. I would have 42, but someone decided to stream in the morning. I'm sorry. I was bored yesterday, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Yes, anybody who has 40k or more points, uh, DM me with uh, what you would redeem, what you would use the redeem for. Um, yep, I know, I know you already did, Nick. <laughs> We're about to have a war of gods. About to have a war of gods? Oh god, oh shit. We oh god, are all which one? gonna die. Uh, it's Woo! it's more gonna be a war between the viewers because after somebody the first person redeems the choosing it is going to be turned off for at least a month oh shit so whoever gets there first gets there first oh my god I am afraid. I am afraid. As you should be. <laughs> but now, who should we raid? Me. You're not streaming, man. I can't raid you. <laughs> <laughs> Offline raid. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I don't know. So, um, I mean, Kisa's streaming. Um, one of uh, uh. Uh, a, a mutual, uh, Ranu Lee is streaming right now, but that's about it, other than, like, the big streamers, like, Tubbo and Shy Lily, unless you want to raid them. Yeah, I keep forgetting that I'm subscribed to Critical, and I, and I see him pop up, and I'm like, damn, I've, like, never watched him. <laughs> <laughs> Mood. Did you sub, or were you gifted a sub? No, I, I, I I'm, not, I'm not subbed to him, I follow him. Uh, oh. And so he shows up on my follow channel, so I'm like, damn, I keep forgetting that I followed him. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, all right, let's go. Let's... Maybe find another D and D streamer, give some love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's let's go. With find the D &D. another D and D campaign. I was actually looking at it earlier, and there's a lot of people playing Curse of Strad. Ooh. Brandon, Curse of Strad is good. Oh yeah, no, Curse of Strad is really great. Um, I am going. I miss Curse of Stride. Bring it back. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, man. Um, I am actually going to be uh, running Curse of Stride again in the future, but that is uh, for a personal game where we all kind of like trade off who's the DM. So it'll be like uh, every two weeks. So like uh, right now we're running a homebrew campaign uh, and a Cyberpunk Red campaign, and then once the homebrew ends and we're still doing Cyberpunk, then I'm gonna jump in with Curse of Strahd, and so it'll be like an every two weeks kind of deal. 
um, which is the only way I'm going to be able to run two games <laughs> at the moment. Oh, no. That's totally fair. Um, that's one of the things that kind of like confuse me sometimes about D&D or a lot of the games I'm in, is it doesn't have to be weekly. It can be bi-weekly. It could be once a month. Why does it have to be weekly? Uh, I mean, Who if made you... it this way? I mean, it doesn't necessarily have to be weekly. Um, I mean, if you guys want to change the schedule, you can, we can always talk about it in chat later. Um, I mean, I'm not mad about this game. No, I'm not saying that. I just mean, like, in a lot of games that I have been in, and a lot of games that I've been invited to, it's always like, are you guys free Wednesday or Saturday? It's like, when it could be, like, once a month thing. I'm looking at you, Emma. It's been, Hi, like, four sorry. months. It's just oh, much easier shit. weekly because Emma, it has been. four months. Listen, I'm tired, okay? <laughs> <laughs> it's All been right. four months. When are we going to go back to the Feywilds? Anyway, yes, Kay? Uh, <laughs> looks like we've got, uh, we got a uh, negative two charisma uh, who is playing Curse of Strahd. That is a very misleading name. They are very charismatic. <laughs> All right, let's go and raid them. <gasps> Wait, I get counter spell. Nice. I should have gotten it a, lo a while ago, but I kept wanting to get more spells. But now I have no more spells that I want to get. Oh wait, no, I already have. Okay, spell. bestow oh, curse shit. or animate dead. Alrighty, gamers. I'm gonna send you guys over to negative two charisma. It looks like they might still be just starting their stream. Or no, they're they're not. I think they're on break because they're about two hours in. Um, give them some love, and yeah. we'll see you guys Yay. next time. Bye. 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 Don't die. <laughs> okay, but like, would Andy?